<laughs> Why is it so good? It's the mu it's it's the drums. It's the drums, right? good holy shit yeah. hey hi hello there happy 10 month anniversary cute purple dragon hype yeah <laughs> thank you sophie for the sob 10 months does that mean that we have a twitch baby now twitch bab yeah yeah all right guys Get ready for the noise. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> but thank you, Sophie, for the sub. <laughs> again! We go again! <laughs> again! I can just listen to Spire Music on Spotify for all- yeah, 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 it's so good. We need to turn the game off, I think. Just because the music's so good. Oh, fuck yeah. Turn that shit up! <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah! Sounds- sounds good, man. Sounds good, man. What a game, though. I know, it's so good. This game is, like, my ultimate chill game. Such, such a vibe, this game. We have a cute Twitch Bambino. Oh, oh. Yeah, I, I, I went to Pet Spyro. He's so cute. He's so adorable. The noise. Thank you, friend, for the host as well. Yeah, I always like Spyro better than Crash as well. I always enjoyed it more. Have you played the Reignite Trilogy? Yes. I very much like um, the Reignited Trilogy. Let's do on this one. I very much like it, but I still prefer the original. I don't know if that's just nostalgia or what, but I, I don't know. I think it's just, it looks cute. Okay, rolling. Oh, it's been peaceful here in the five worlds. I don't know, it's just like PS1 games. Or a Dragon's or... Age. We now have 12,000 A vibe. Treasure, or is it 14,000? They just look nice. They what look about nice. this Ganasty Ganork character? Now I understand he's found a magic spell to turn gems <laughs> into warriors for his Yeah, cause. yeah. I'll take that question. We played Nasty the Reignited Nord. Trilogy on stream, and Lily Bad was giving me loads and loads of cheat codes that change Spyro. <laughs> and there's like a PS1 Bro, original rat. model, which is so adorable. Ugly. That does it. So good. Did you just swear any customers on like at work on your last day? Down. I didn't, actually. There wasn't any problem customers. There wasn't any. Not one. But hey, Retro. And hey, Bit Smasher as well. And hey, Mar Mike. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't say hi. Who have we got any of you? Who have we got? Let me say hi to everybody first. We've got Lily, Kodru. We've got Jay, Sophie, Marmike, Fran, Miss Fashion. Nice. Hey, Mr. J. Hey, Mr. J. Button. Thank you for releasing me. Shall we listen to all the dragons or shall we skip them? I don't mind listening to them. It'll transport you to the next world. What about nasty Newark? I'm, I'm going after, after him. him. Dragons first. What are all the models That's and textures like jumping jump. like that? I mean, it's just it's just how it be, isn't it? You can see like some of the um, 
the lines on where the polygons end and stuff. <laughs> I'm gonna do 120% because it's, you know, it's fun. It's fun. You just got sushi? Nice. What kind of sushi? Where's Nasty Nork? I'll torch you. I'll torch Keep you. your horns on, Spyro. You have Everyone much to learn first. To get to swear. Do you know what the dragonfly yeah, yeah, yeah. following you is doing? <laughs> um. His name is Sparks, and he's helping and protecting yeah. you. Yeah. Keep when an we, eye on we him. We were closing up the shop. I, mean? I was like, I'll do an announcement, and I was like, should I swear? <laughs> Should I be like, get the fuck out of here? But I didn't in the end. <laughs> it would have been funny though. Let's do the flying level. Get it out of the way, because I'm always rubbish at these ones. We just do it first, fuck it. A PS1 can't render 3D infractions or something, can't remember, but it's something like that. Oh, this is the music again! Yeah, dude! This is the tune. Oh, I missed it. Fine. Oh god. What a tune, though. It's the it's the drums, right? All the songs have got really good drums and really good bass. Sounds fucking good, man. Should have been like, peace out, fuckers. I'm out of here. See you later. Is the game too loud, by the way? Because I've turned this shit up really high because I like it. I like music. But if it's too loud, I can turn it back down again. Do, 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 do. I missed him. Do, 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 do. I am aware, I do, that the order a bit scuffed. Yeah, I'm not a speedrunner. I don't know the optimal way of doing it. I just go for it. Oh no. Oh dear. Oh dear. I don't know. I don't know about this, guys. <laughs> oh shit. Oh fuck! I fucked it! We're gonna have to do it again. We're gonna have to do it again. That's fine. Dragon, dragon, dragon! I fucked it. I think I do the planes. I do the planes before I get that last ring. I think. Yeah, I. The fly levels are the ones I'm the worst at, which is why I do them first. <laughs> Get them out of the way. Do, 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 do. I learned how to roll sushi when I was in the military, living in Hawaii. That's interesting. I never tried to make sushi or anything like that. But I really like sushi. Sign had the same issue, but to a lesser extent. Yeah, it, it's just, it's kind of just a retro y game thing, isn't it? A retro y game thing, guys. <laughs> Where's the last plane? Little shit. Alright, that worked out a lot better, didn't it? Now we do trains. Do, 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 do. I wish I could crank the music higher. Like, I wish I could crank the music higher than the actual sound effects in this game, but I don't think that you can in the menu. Let's go! Spyro Dragon! <laughs> Let's go! It's your boy! Oh, wait. Mm. 
It's your boy. I don't know if I got all of them. I usually get all the gems in the level. Oh fuck. Before I go to the levels, but fuck it. I'm just I'm just gonna do the levels as at the same time. I'm usually very OCD and I'm like, I'll get everything in the home world first, but I'll uh, just do it later. I'll do it later. Thank you for the follow, Big C. I hope that you are having a good day. Everybody? I'm vibing right now. I'm chilling. I'm chilling. Killing. Oof. <laughs> uh, if, if I get Jay, because I want Jay to do me some um, alerts. Thank you for the followings of Wax as well. Very nice. I missed that. <laughs> um, I want Jay to do me some follow alerts and we're going to have to have a Spyro one. I don't know if Jay could do something like that. But we need, we need a Spyro. Follow alert. When you free a dragon or step on one of their platforms, doing well Wednesday. I had a progress. seizure. Oh my that god! Holy shit! Trouble. I, ho I hope you're alright. You ever run into Man? trouble, Spyro? That's terrifying. That's terrifying. Are you okay now? God. Do you think the fly levels in the first game are the hardest? They made them a little easier in Spyro 2. Yeah, they are a bit more easy in Spyro 2. Thank you, Lums, for those. Sarah was away for a moment because I had, because I as, was fighting with someone on Discord. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Good. You do know a lot better. Good. Good. That's what we like to hear. I think if like somebody's having a seizure, I'm not 100% sure because I've never actually seen it, but I think you're just supposed to let it happen, aren't you? Like you're not, you're not supposed to pass this try and move them or anything, I don't think. Thingamay. Just as long as their head is not, to the home. like, the first smacking name against story. something. No thanks. See ya. Well, I'm not an expert on that. Yeah. Sparrow was originally supposed to be green. Yeah, but the developers thought it would blend in with the grass. Yeah, it's true. It is true. Did I just get that key? No, I didn't. See, um, that's what I'm talking about. I'm trying to read the chat that I forget things. Playing Buster Groove on my PS1. Never played that. I think you should grab the tongue Watch so it doesn't get swallowed. Oh god. His color indicates his I, I don't know. When he eats butterflies, I don't know what you're actually strong. supposed to do. Uh, sure. I like... I like Spyro's voice in this game. He sounds so... like, snarky. You know? Where's Nasty Dork? I've been, I've been through that one. Uh, did, they, did they change his voice in the second game? I'm sure they did. He doesn't sound as snarky. Excuse me. Ouch. You know those guys used to scare me. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Fear? Fear? Godius? I apologize if I say everybody's name wrong. I really am sorry. Need to find this for my PS4, but it's so damn expensive. I've. I don't think. Oh, dude. 
I've got a couple PS1 games left that my mum didn't get rid of, and I think I've got Spyro still. Spyro, my friend, how about a hint on gliding? You bet, you bet. For the longest <laughs> glide, press the X button at the top of a jump, and try pressing the triangle button to drop down in mid-flight. Because there was a couple of PS1 games that I took to uni with me. So I took Spyro. Um, and like Final Fantasy 7. Some games that like are very comfy games to me. Just in case, like I always play these games when I'm feeling a bit down. I don't feel down today, but it's just something that I like to play. If I don't know what else to play, you know. If I'm undecided. This is like a, such a comfy game. Egg Thief is fucking, he's going for it. Look at him. I'm going for, coming for you, little shit. Come here. Look at him. What? <laughs> okay. Fair enough. I guess he wanted to die. <laughs> you just turned around for no reason. Thank you! <laughs> Made it easier for me, my dude. Clancy Brown voicing the old dragon. I love the I love all of the voices in this game. They're good. Is that it? One? Oh it's there. Is that it? Yeah. Yeah. I didn't realize that you could quit out of the levels when I was younger. I thought you had to go to like the end goal to actually save the progress of the level, but you can just quit out. I, I didn't know that until I actually, I streamed this game and somebody told me and I was like, oh, all right. Good to know. Yeah, little shit. Same. <laughs> yeah, there's like quite a few things that I've learned on stream from people telling me, which is really cool. But yeah, today I didn't know what to play. Today I was like, oh, I don't know what to play. I was gonna play um, Jack and Daxter, and then I was like, "Ooh, I haven't played Spyro in a while." We'll play Spyro. Spyro's awesome. All right, I'm gonna go get the key first before I go up there. Actually, Wilfury Dude! Wilfury Dude! <laughs> oh no! Oh, it's okay. Didn't hit me, it's fine. <laughs> Can't go wrong with a classic. Play Tomb Raider 1? Absolutely not. Never been a fan of Tomb Raider. Don't hate me, but I I've never been a fan of it. I don't I don't really like them. Not gonna lie. Have you seen any of the prototypes of this game? Like when Spyro was green? We were just talking about that. Um, I, I, I like that they went with purple. Very, very nice. I'm here but leaky, leaky for a while, playing some Fallout New Vegas. No worries, Corvix. I hope that you have fun with the Fallout. I think it's very good, that game. <clears throat> Just Kate, Kate just don't like the polygon boobs. <laughs> I didn't say oh, that. Your secret's safe with me. Lara Croft has got some very nice um, triangle titties. I'll give it that. Been playing SMT5 all day. How is it? How is it? I'm very interested in that game. 
very interested in it. I don't think it's a game that I would stream. It would be like an off, off stream game, you know. It's so good. Can't remember if he was green in the one I, I saw. Had almost four levels that never made it into the final game. Oh, it's you. I'd love for them to release to stuff like that, critics. you know. Of course they would. For people to play. Me, but here's a hint. Metal armor That's why you're not streaming it. But a charge yeah. Metal it's very itself. it's very um Stream it, Megami Tensei. Games are very grindy. But good fun. I actually prefer the vibe of SMT to Persona. Personally, like, I, I'm not a huge fan of, like, the school sim aspect of Persona, really. And it's not as bad in the SMT games. Yeah, it's a bit more adult. Which I prefer. Might have asked this before, but have you played Legend? No, I haven't played Legend of Dragoon, actually. I've heard that it's very good. Shit, the last few days at work have been for me. Like I just wanted to potato and have some me time. Charm. Yeah. But a quick flame. That should defeat them. Yeah. I get you. I get you. It's your favorite game of all time, so I'm biased. I think everybody's got like a game like that where they're like super huge fan of. And you can like look look over all of its faults. I'm like that with Resi 4. I'm like, Resi 4 is the best game of all time, nobody can tell me otherwise. I don't give a shit what anybody says. <laughs> I love that game. So good. Alright, let's go do... Well, let's go up here first, actually. Did I kill both of these guys? I don't even remember. Just for the gem. Yeah, I did. Whatever. We'll do the town level, and then we'll do the boss level. Rose from Legend hey, of Dragoon is my first waifu. Nice. And, and don't be afraid I don't know who my waifu is. What? I don't know. Falling from high mountain peaks, plummeting into prehistoric glaciers. Oh, I would say Leon is like my husband, but only in Resi 4. I don't like any other ver like I don't find any other version of him super attractive. It's just the Resi 4 version of him that I like. Like he's a total cutie in 2, but he's like a baby. Like he's very young and cute, you know. In 4 he's like a bit of a chad. <laughs> and he cracks me up. Like, he's, he's such a snarky little bastard, and I love him for that. I don't know who, uh, what, what my wife who would be, I don't know. I've got too many, I think, is the issue. Every time I play a game, I'm like, oh lord, there's a babe in this game, holy shit. There's more hot girls in games than hot guys, in my opinion. You lost stream totally again? Oh god, I hope it's not on my end. I hope that the stream is not super laggy and shit. I oh god, I hope not. This is a bit of a bop as well. Nah, that stream is fine. I think that uh, Bitsmasher was having issues with his internet, wasn't he? That's why... Yeah, internet. Internet connection. Welcome to Town Square, Spyro. 
Begin I have a waifu for whatever game or anime, but Rose would just wear fierce, the yeah. Use the L2 Sorry, and I will have R2 to quit and come back next time. Oh, that's look. okay, Bitsmash, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I hope that you have a nice day. Oh my god. I got up here! No way! Thank you for releasing me! I always try to get up here, but I could never do it and I actually did it. Nice. I don't think that it's intended. Nice. Well, I'm gonna go this way anyway. A fun fact is that in the version of the game that I used to play, in the PAL version of this game, the bulls don't have red on their horns. Like, they don't have the blood on the horns. Because that's too violent. It's too violent, so they took it out of the PAL version. Which is quite funny. Do you violent for us European kids? Thanks, Pyro. <laughs> I had the worst itch on the tip of my wing. Did, Did you, you know, know that you get your longest glides <laughs> by pressing know? X at the very top of your jump? I, I love the voice acting in this game, dude. <laughs> at the very top of your jump. Let's try to get this egg thief now. God, I hate it. I got you! Little bitch. Egg. 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 Do 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 do. Just get that gem, yeah. Yeah, I really like the Reignited trilogy, but there's something there's something off. There's something off about the controls, and I, I can't really tell what it is. It feels like the gliding is way harder. Did you see a man dressed in for some reason? Like here? you don't get he's as much height. And he's stolen a dragon egg. You've got to track him down and, and get that egg. Run! Like run! you do that you do that um that bog weird. level in this here where you have to supercharge and some of the jumps are like really hard. They're like a million times harder in the remake for some reason, and I don't know what it is about it. It just feels like you don't get enough height whenever you jump. Uh, it might just be me. It might just be me, but it just feels slightly off. It might just be because I'm so used to this version that I've got such bad muscle memory for it that because it's slightly different, it messes me up. Excuses, I know, I know, just excuses for being bad. Cool flash, do, do that, that again. The Dude, I, I know all the words this game. You. <laughs> you can challenge me now if you feel I, I, you are ready. I play this game so much. It's just too good. Toasty. Now this, this music is. Oh, this this is a bit of a bop. This one. Once, once it kicks in, it's like, oh, oh yeah. I don't like these dogs. Question for you guys. Have you ever used the roll in this game? Like, in general? Like, this game has got a roll in it. 
like a side roll. <laughs> Has anybody ever used it? I've seen people use it in speedruns. Um, but it's quite good for speedruns, but I, I've never seen anybody use it casually. Just to mess around off a gameplay, yeah. I've never found it super useful for me, personally. But if, if you guys have never seen a speedrun of this game, I'd highly recommend it. It's, it's so cool to watch it be played, like, super fast. Aim, excuse me! Me, but the dragonfly is named Sparks. Yes. Nasty Nork has put one of his most devious henchmen in charge Sparks. of the artisan world. Bring him on. I think I smell a barbecue. barbecue. Be careful, Spyro. <laughs> this boss has this many tricks boss up his has sleeve. Many tricks up his sleeve, dude. They call him a boss. That's so funny. I like it when games do that. But like, like the characters will actually say, press the X button to jump. This is just me, but I find it easier to kill the dogs if I just spin around in a circle. This dude used to scare me. Yeah, the, the pumpkin guy. He's quite terrifying. But it's just a sheep. It's just a cute sheep. Don't worry guys, no sheep were harmed in the making of this video game. Don't worry about it. Yeah, I, I prefer Sparks when he didn't speak. <laughs> because he ta he starts talking, doesn't he? At some point. I don't remember what game it is, but he starts talking and it's like, oh no. Because I know that he talks in Hero's Tale, which is what Lily was playing recently, but I don't know if he started talking in an earlier game than that. I don't know. I don't remember. But he's quite annoying, and I, I don't, I don't like it when he talks. That's good. Well, Spyro, I see you've been busy rescuing dragons. You may travel to the Peacekeeper's world if you like. Yes, please. I like how he jumps on his head. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> I think it was the Enter the Dragonfly. Oh god. I had that game when I was a kid, and even as a kid, I didn't like it really. I was like, mmm. Mmm. For me, nothing beats this first game for me. Welcome to Peacekeeper, Spyro. Look how our treasure is us and stolen. Recover our treasure, Spyro. Kind of a beast. Collect treasure. Got it. Him. I'm not even going to talk about the fact that the dragons are super hot in the Reignited Trilogy for some reason. They just made them really hot. They're such... They're such scaly bait, man. They knew what they were doing. They knew what they were doing. <laughs> and I... You know... I'm not into that, but I can appreciate it. It's the voices they gave them. They gave them really hot voices. Man, it's not my fault. It's not my fault that they sound hot. You what? Have you heard them? They're really attractive sounding. What's his name? What's his name that we like, Lily? 
the guy that voices people. He does prompto. What's his name? He's a couple of dragons in that game. No, I'm not! <laughs> I'm not! Robbie Damon, yeah, that's, that's the guy. It's not my fault, but he's got a nice voice. Come here. Oof. <laughs> Even Lily likes him. I nearly bumped that again. Yeah, you bastard. Oof. Yeah, exactly that. Th it's the voice, see? Even Lily's with me on this one. Not just me. For releasing me. <laughs> Have you listened to the dragons in this game? Thank you for releasing me. <laughs> it, move. I'm not sure which way to go, so I'm just gonna go this way for this. Fuck it. If we have to come back on ourselves, we can. <laughs> Liam O'Brien, dude. Oh, dude, Liam O'Brien's hottest voice that he's ever done is that fucking book from me. Is that you, Sparrow? <laughs> Are you the young dragon I've been hearing so much about? Like, thank you, Liam O'Brien, for making me attracted spoke. to a fucking him. book. You've known? Ah, that's a good. <laughs> like, come on now. It's just the voice. It's purely the voice. Ah, you little bastard! How dare you? How dare you, for starters? Oh, this game is such a vibe. Such a vibe! One of my favourite things in this game is the colour palette. I love the colour palettes in this game. Like, all of the sky boxes are so pretty. They're so pretty. There's a website. I'll have to find it and put it in the Discord or something. But there's a website where somebody ripped all of the sky boxes in this game and like, you know, spread them out. And they look so nice. Very, very gorgeous looking. Oh, I haven't got the key um, for the chest over there. So I'm just not gonna fly over there yet then. I know where the key is. I remember. The voice he did in that is is what is the is the same as he used for Caius. I haven't played Final Fantasy 13 2. I haven't played it. Alright, the key's this way. I only need to play it for him. Dry Canyon rewards good glider. Boris. <laughs> you are a good glider, eh, Spyro? I don't know I why. Wound glide. But <laughs> Boris is always the name that I give to spiders that I find in the house. <laughs> always Boris. We've got a fucking big, big Boris spider in that lives in the bathroom and he just lives in there. And we just let him live in there because he's chilling. He's chilling. And if there's any flies that get in, then he'll he'll eat them. So it's all it's all good. 
we like him. Alright, it's this way. Maximus. Incredible glide, Spyro. Incredible glide, Spyro. I thought I'd be Spyro. stuck here forever with those ugly vultures standing on my head. Those birds might look tough, but they're pretty tasty. Flame broiled, mm. with a pinch of salt. Mm. I want flame grilled chim kim. That sounds delicious. Alright, don't jump in the portal like a silly sausage. Alright, let's go get a chest and then we're done. That's all super late though, to be fair. Like everything? Yeah. Yeah. Proper sloth, I know. I know, I'm so lazy. Work all day? But you enjoy your job though, don't you, Jay? Not working, you have back to the uni sleeping pattern. Dude, I need to keep it under control though, you know? I want to start, you know, doing stuff um, to keep my to keep my brain active. I'm gonna start eating healthier. I'm gonna start working out as well, just to keep myself healthy. I'm gonna start going for walks. I think as well, because there's a park right next to where I live, so I'm gonna start walk. Like a little daily walk in the park. Be nice. Wish I had a dog. The dog would definitely keep me active. You know? I haven't been to this one yet, have I? Yes. Yes, I guess it would be 2 pm. Carnage said 1 pm. I win. <laughs> are you guys. Are you guys having bets on what time I wake up in the morning. <laughs> yeah, I've missed Carnage's last two streams because he's finished streaming before I've woken up. Goddamn Aussie times. He started streaming at like 9am, hasn't he? Which is early for me. On a day off, that's early. Excuse me. How dare you? Oh. What even are these things? I've always wondered. Are they like lizards or something? I don't know. Can't tell. Maybe. <laughs> you guys always pick it on me. Quit picking on me. How 
removal. How's a dragon supposed to flame metal armor anyway? You can't, you Remember, silly. Spyro, flame won't harm metal, but charging with your horns, that should do the trick. I like how the game is just telling us this now. Like, we're already past the first world now. Like, we're in the second world. <laughs> I need all these lives, man. I need all these lives for that one level with the supercharged jumps. I'm absolutely shit at them. Although, I'll have to show you guys. Um, I've been doing, you know that one level where it's got the really obnoxious supercharged jumps, the, the, the bog level. There's a super easy way of doing it, and I didn't know, because I'm stupid. I'll have to show you guys. It's actually so annoying, but I've been doing it wrong all this time. All these years. There's an easy way? What? I know! It's fucking sad. <laughs> so like, you're supposed to go like, up the normal way, and there's like loads of different, um, like, ramps, isn't there, that you're supposed to go around? You don't even need to use any of them. You literally don't even need to use any of them. There's like, a different way that you can go. <laughs> it's so sad, but I've never known. <laughs> I think the way that we've always done it is like the intended way, but people have figured out a better way of doing it, obviously. But when people do speed runs and stuff like that. Hey, what's on the other side of that river? Why don't you glide there and find out? Oh baby, I'm going I'm going to. I'm going to. Don't you worry about it. But first I'm gonna go over here. Let's get these. Mind is blown. My mind was blown. Does anybody else have like a comfy game? This is my comfy game. I would say Jack and Daxter won. Is a very comfy game as well. Because they're both games that I can complete in like one sitting, and it's very satisfying to get all of the 100%. Because it's not too hard, is it? It's just like a nice, chill time. Like, there are some games, that's why I don't like the sequels to this game as much. Because to get the 100% you've got to do like a load of stupid mini games and stuff that are just wildly annoying. So I just don't like them as much. You've reached the highest point in Cliff Town. You can get to almost anywhere from here. If I were you, this and did you want Cyber Sleuth? There. I've never played a Digimon game apart from that Digimon World game. And I didn't know what to do in that Digimon World game. <laughs> My Digimon would just die immediately and I'd be like, alright. Didn't know how to play it. Maybe Contra on the NES? Or one of the Mega Drive Sonics. See, Contra is very hard, but I suppose if you grow up with it, it might be easier, I guess. But Mega Drive Sonics are, are chill, yeah. But I, I don't go for the emeralds, though. Emeralds are too annoying. I hate the special stages in some of them. I just don't want to do them, pretty much. Too annoying. 
especially in Sonic 1. I absolutely hate the special stages in Sonic 1. Like, they give me a headache. Hi, Spyro! Sparks the Dragonfly has been doing like a good Earthbound. job protecting Dude, him. Dude, Earthbound's Make awesome. Make sure to keep him strong by feeding him lots of butterflies. Earthbound's actually, like... I, pre I played it, like, I think it was last year, in my own time, not on stream. And it's so funny. Like, it's it's a really funny game. It's way ahead of its time, in my opinion. And, like, I like the, the weird enemies and... It's like I love the cute art style to it. Like it's it's super unusual that game. I can see why it didn't do very well at the time because it, it is super different. But it's really good. I I like it a lot. It is top tier. Really hate the ones in Sonic 2. Yeah, the ones they're actually so annoying if you got tails. Tails ruins them. Fucking tails. Mother 3 is fantastic also. A word of caution. Is Mother 3 the one that wasn't Waiting translated over it. here? Like me. Before and you have to get like a fan. Large enemies. A fan in patch for it, or am I thinking of a different mother game? So no one of them was never translated, was it, properly? And everyone was always asking for it all the time. Tails was my sister's favorite character for me, though I prefer Knuckles. Knuckles is my boy. I love Knuckles. Knuckles is my favorite, favorite Sonic character, but Knuckles, your boy. Knuckles has dreadlock, so he is automatically best. Yeah, dude. Psst. Spyro. Some big norks up ahead are wearing armor, and in the ice cave, armor. Yeah, can you can make get a good fan patch slippery. for it. Hmm. Yeah. So, so they never did translate Mother Three then officially. You have to do the fan patch for it. That's sad, isn't it? You'd think that Nintendo would do that because I mean they put the characters in Smash, so they obviously care about the characters. It's just weird, isn't it? That they wouldn't translate it. It's super strange. Oh god. I'm going this way first and then we'll come back to do the rest of that area, because the box is up there, so... Do this way first. Go this way. Why not? That's the one I have the fan translation. Thank you it's for really releasing good. me. <gasps> the Scottish dragon, dude. Thank you for releasing me. I can't do Scottish. <laughs> Amazing. Hello, Sailor Ocarina. I'm sorry, I didn't say hi to you straight away. I'm sorry. Hello. I hope that you're doing well. Do you like Spyro? Popularity of Smash Bros. Nintendo would release all three games. Yeah, it's been it's super weird that they haven't done that because they make money on it. Because now everybody knows the games are really good. Like they're well liked. I think that they do quite well. You do, you love Spyro? Nice. Oof. <laughs> Sparrow's one of my childhood faves. I love this game very much. I feel like this is the best game in the series, personally. Um, and the music is also the best as well, I think. In my opinion. I like it. I like this game a lot. Like, like we were saying earlier, it just doesn't have as much busy work. Oh, I missed that gem! Dude. Oh, it's a good thing that I spotted it, isn't it, really? 
We would have been wandering around for a one gem. Oh god. Terrible. Are you playing on emulate? I am indeed. Sadly, my PS2 is extremely unwell. <laughs> it's extremely unwell. How much are PS2 slims these days? Can you get one relatively cheap? Or are they like... Because I'd rather get a slim, I think. Because my PS2 is like the original fat one. And I think that they're just prone to breaking after a certain amount of time. I've heard that the slims are a bit better. But I haven't actually looked up how much they are. Forever Mission, just one gem. Thank you for releasing me. Thank you for releasing me. <laughs> yeah. That's such a cool Vix voice. We'll get this way first. Sixty-five quid CX. Not bad, is it really? Would you recommend going for a slim model retro over a fat model? It's quite reasonable, isn't it? Yeah, it's not bad. wish that Sony would put like all the PS1 classics on the PlayStation Store because they used to do that on the PS3 but they don't do it anymore for PS4 or PS5 and it's like why not? I don't understand why they don't do it. They, they make a lot of sales on it. Like my PlayStation Vita is literally just a PS1 machine. It's got all the PS1 classics on it. I think I might um, mess around with my Vita and just make it into like an emulation machine. <laughs> just put all of the ROMs on it. Fuck it. It's not like they're gonna make any more games for it anyway. It's supposed to be quite good for emulation. So... I've heard that the Wii U is very good for emulation. So you don't like money. Giving up on waiting for Sony, well, that's why I just emulate. Yeah, that's the thing. Ready, but I knew they were wrong. If you can't ready, buy right. these games ready for a reasonable for price, and they're not released on any kind of modern hardware, then what do they expect, really? People are gonna emulate, it's not our fault. Go for slimline, more reliable, takes up less space, think it has an included modem as well. Yeah, I'll go for the slim then. Because I would like to play some more like PS2 games on stream because a lot of PS2 games just don't emulate properly, do they? Which is a shame. Like I had to mess around with Scaler and I, I can't get it working properly honestly, it just doesn't want to work so... Sadly, I'm gonna try the GameCube version to see if I can get that working bit better. You want this game that came out 20 years ago, give us three times the original price for a digital copy. I mean, not even digital copy, because I, can you even buy this on anything other than the P PS3 store you can? But I don't think you can on the PS4 or the PS5, I don't think, which is super annoying. And you can't like... Because I've got a, quite a lot of uh, PS1 and PS2 games that I bought on the PS3. 
and you can't play them on the PS4 even though it's a joint account. Like, it just doesn't play them. It's really dumb. PS2 seems difficult to emulate. It, it's got a couple of weird issues with it, yeah. I wonder why it is like that. There's, there's got to be like a technical reason for it because people love PS2. It, it doesn't make sense for people to not try and make the emulation really good on it. it it's obviously an issue that can't be fixed. Music in this level is way louder than all of the other levels in the game. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why. I, I, I've got no idea. That didn't do anything, really. Oh god. Oh shit. Oh god fucking hell. This music is nuts. <laughs> it's good. I like it. I don't think there's any health in this level. This is a boss level. PS2 emulator on Metroark and it worked really well. Guess, guess what game I tested? Go on. Go on, Jay. What, what game what game are you playing? This music is a bit of a bop though. Fucking Sony. Freaking Sony, you freaking fricks. But PS4, PS5 are apparently very, very nice to develop for, so they did learn the lesson eventually. It took them a while, but. Did anyone play this guy Gift? He's so cool. Gift? You don't know what it's been like. On PS2? To I've over and not over. heard of it. But I'll tell you one thing. He, he should watch his back. back. I, don't, I don't know, I've not heard that game. Gif. Never heard of it. This guy. Yeah, do that. <laughs> this boss. So he's still gonna fucking whack me, isn't he? This guy. I've got green sparks. Not good. PS4 was famous for being awesome to develop for, so it's kind of, yeah, the PS3 was an absolute fucking nightmare, apparently. Ew! Ew! <laughs> oh, fuck. Wow! Die! Oh, got no sparks! I got no sparks, dude! Oh, I've got to pick up the gems! Whee! I hate it. I knew this would happen. All right, wait. See if I get my chest. Did I get everything. Ooh! There's a tinge. Oh. I missed this chest apparently. Good! Fine. Fine. Crisis averted. 
Holy shit. Okay, the, the, the music should not be horrifically loud now, I apologize. It's just in that level for some reason. How unusual. Never heard of GIF before. No, me neither. Not heard of it. Oh, I've still got no sparks, dude. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. This is flying level. Flying level? Oh, I hate the flying level. Ugh. Sure you've seen that box art years ago? I'm gonna have to look at the box art. Even Aaron hadn't heard of it. It must be like a super rare game then. I don't know the optimal path for this level. I'm just doing it. Bit of a cat gem. the intro screen music for it. I'm gonna have to look it up. <laughs> the box art looks terrifying. All right, all right, wait. I, I need to look at this. PS2, gift. Whoa, <laughs> whoa. I feel like I've seen that box art. Like, I feel like I've seen that, but I've never played that game. I've absolutely never played that. But it, it looks familiar though. It looks familiar. Thank you for the follow. Retro Militia. <laughs> Thank you. For the follow. Very much. I hope that you're having a great day. I've still got no sparks. Oh, fucking hell. Shit. Camera, please. There we go. Give me the boy back. <laughs> The Spyro. The Sparks, even. I just called Spark Spyro. Ignore me. Wow, he didn't even try. He didn't even try, that guy. He looks like one of the creatures. Well done, Spyro. Keep up the good work, and I know you'll fulfill your destiny. Destiny? I just want to kick some- Just toast those enemies <laughs> yeah. and collect the treasure! Dude, I used to have a creatures game on my Game Boy Advance and I had no idea what to do in it. I didn't understand how to play the game. Like, I didn't understand it. It was like some kind of... Sim game. Where you had to take care of them and raise them and I didn't understand it. When I was a wee... A wee bab. I didn't know. It very much confused me. Have I got everything now? In this area? Yeah, dude. Oh god. Oh god. Get to the balloonist quick. Or I kill myself. Silly. Gosnold. I can't believe how fast you found so much solid tre treasure. Hop aboard for the Magic Crafters world if you're ready. Yeah. I like the Magic Crafters. It's weird. I like every- I like every- There isn't any level in this game where I'm like, oh, 
I don't like this level. You know, I, I enjoy all of them really. The only level that I get myself all worked up over is that supercharged level. Little shit, come here. Oof. Like when I was little, little bab kitty, the supercharged level used to make me cry. <laughs> Welcome to Magic Crafters. I used to be like, to I can't do this level. <laughs> I can't from those find all the gems. Feet. I used to cry. I'm such a baby. Such a baby. There's, a, there's another level when I was a kid as well. I had no idea where the gems were. Like I was always missing like five or something and I could never figure it out. It wasn't until I got like the internet that I was like, I remember looking it up one day. I was like, I'm gonna look it up, see where they are. And my mind was blown. <laughs> mind was blown. Whoa. This level used to scare me, actually. This level right here used to scare me when I was a kid. He's <laughs> terrifying me. These creatures in here are just absolutely terrifying to me. Look at that, dude! <laughs> oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. I hated it. And they roar at you as well. Young Kida was terrified. Low poly sub is always scary. Yeah, yeah, there's something that happens, right? Whenever they remake like a PS1 game, it just doesn't look right anymore. Everything's too soft, you know? It's too rounded around the edges. Like things just don't look as good. To me, anyway. Like, I still prefer the way this game looks compared to the, the remasters, like the remakes. The remakes look really, really nice. Like, they did a, su a super good job on them, but I still prefer You're not afraid of those big, the noisy, PS1 gigantic, graphics. awful beasts, are you? Of course not. I didn't think so. I didn't think so. <laughs> Forever on green, Sparks, at the minute. Egg. 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 <laughs> Why is egg such a good word? We were having this conversation the other day. It's because of things that end in g. Like bug. Egg. Anything with good as a noise. Ah! Oh, you little shit. Almost knocked me off. I would have been very upset if you would have knocked me off. That fat wizard. I like when, when you get up, you're like, ah! <laughs> That's funny. This game's got a lot of personality to it. I like it. I like it as well when Sparks is eating a butterfly. He doesn't pick up the gems because he's busy. He's, he's, he's too busy for that. Which is a quite, quite a nice feature. Oh, wait. Give me that guy. Oh, I don't know. Am I might. Ah! <laughs> oh. I already knew as soon as I jumped, I was like, that's not gonna. I'm not gonna get over there. <laughs> ah! I want 
do all the commands just to see what they do. I mean, that's what they're there for. That's what they're there for. Feel free. Some of them are just sounds. Some of them are like video alerts. Oh, I thought I did it again. I thought I did it again. Yeah, knock yourself out. Knock oh, yourself thank out. Thank you for releasing me, Colonel. <laughs> I'm trying to sneak around, <laughs> but I'm dumb thick. thick. And the clap of my ass cheeks keeps alerting the guards. <laughs> so good. Snake is a bit of a hot guy in um like well big boss is is hotter right he's a bit more gruff but metal gear solid 5 when whenever you crawling around on the floor he's got a good ass on him he's got a good ass on him i can tell you that Yeah, he's got that junk in the trunk. <laughs> it's a willy. <laughs> willy, you silly sausage. You silly sausage. Great work, Spyro. If you keep this up, you'll learn all the tricks of the magic crafter world. His eyes are weird. His eyes are weird, man. I don't like a dragon. It's freaking me out. Right, don't go back down there. We go this way now. Jose loves it when we say silly sausage. He loves it. He finds it funny. Remember that these Remember. haven't stolen eggs only in the magic I've got, I've got worry, biscuits. I'll take care of them. Don't worry, I'll take care of them. Hello! Should we change the pumpkin dance to something, um, something else? Because it's not Halloween anymore? Or do you guys like it? Kida, you are the best in video games. Especially Mega Man X. Um, well, the first time I ever played it was on stream, and I didn't, on, I honestly didn't know what I was doing, and I got to the last boss, and he was kicking my fucking ass, like, he was literally killing me in, like, two hits, I think, and I was like, oh, fuck this game, it's so hard, like, why is this game so hard, and then everyone in the chat was like, wait, you haven't got any upgrades, and I'm like, what do you mean, upgrades, and they're like, yeah, there's upgrades in this game, and I was like, oh, really? <laughs> so I gave up on the last boss and I'm gonna go back to it one day <laughs> now that I know that the reason why I was so shit at it is because I didn't have all the things that you're supposed to have <clears throat> so I'll replay it one day and get all of the things you can expect a spanking from, from daddy later, later. You see arrows like these <laughs> You can charge along with them to begin a supercharge. Yeah, who's he picking on me? Who's he picking on me? Go ahead, try it. That's why you know, you know who's he. He's always picking on me. That boy, that boy. I should take his diamond away. He doesn't deserve it. That little shit. 
All right, we'll go in this one. Daddy. <laughs> He's a boy. He's got nice hair though. Oh god, gotcha. The most fabulous hair in the land. That is true. So silky smooth. God no. Oh god no. I've played games since then. I've overwritten that save state probably. Unless it saves the save state on a game to game basis, I don't know. Or I don't use that um, emulator anymore. So no is the answer to that. Wait! No, I've gone the wrong way! Wait, wait a second, there's some gems over here. Some gems. I can't I can't I can't miss any gems. I've gotta get all the gems. My like OCD. Get very upset. I've on for too many channels and don't want to mod more channels. I don't blame you for that. Oh fuck that. <laughs> Oof. Make one X3. Ten is it X3? Ten, three. Oh, for fuck's sake. Fuck me. Oh, it's a password save anyway. I mean, I just played from the beginning, man, because the, I basically missed everything in every level. That's the thing. So I'd have to go through the entire game anyway. So I may as well just try and play the game again, right? <laughs> Where he says ow. Give. Give gems. I'm sure this level's got different music in the European version. I could be wrong. 3 would be 13. I hate those bugs. When I become big and strong like you, Final Fantasy I'll squash them all. 13 Until 3. Then, remember that supercharge makes you invincible. It's only boss fights, just enter the levels, pick up tanks and hearts and exit. Could probably done in less than an hour. Yeah. I don't have that save state anymore, sadly. Because I don't use that emulator anymore. It's fine, we'll just play it again one day. The game was fun. It was just that last boss was outrageously difficult. It was just outrageous, and it's because obviously I missed everything. So it's not even the game's fault. Jotun? 
Thank you for the follow. I hope that you're having a great day. Tentu. God, I hate Tentu. Oh, what a horrible video game. Oh. Nearly bonked my head on that. Oh. Try combining supercharge with jumping and gliding and really explore the high caves. I really like in the the remake. All of the dragons have got um all of them look like completely different from one another. Like they're not just recolors. They've got some really, really nice designs in that game. That's very cool. Like they didn't have to obviously do that, but they did it and that's cool. Dude, Baru. Yeah, got all of the spoders. Where's the gem? There. Ain't these spoders yet? It used to scare me when I was young. The spiders. It's like invincible in video games terrified me as a kid like I used to have um, Prince of Persia and it wasn't the first one I think it was I don't remember if it was the second one but it had this creature that would chase you at certain points in the game and it was um, like it was invincible you couldn't kill it terrified me. It was the Prince of Persia game that had like the really metal soundtrack. Whichever one that one is. Did have a super edgy soundtrack. Yes, yes, that, that is the one. Yeah, second one. War yeah, Warrior Within. That, that's what it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the thing that used to chase you in it used to terrify me. Very spook. I'd probably look back at it and be like, wow, I was such a massive wimp. Although, when we replayed Rayman, <laughs> that horrible, horrible uh, green thing that chases you still spooked me out. It still scared me. So, you know, I could just be massive mod. Massive mod. Yeah, Warrior Within. Was that game actually any good? Because I remember quite liking it as a kid. Like, I, I remember playing it and being like, this is awesome. Well, that just might have been because it was edgy. <laughs> and I liked edgy things. No! Oh! I went the wrong way for the chest. It's fine. I missed some gems here, so it's fine. This guy. You were terrified of the crude doodle in that horror game the other day? Oh my god! You talking about I'm scared? That game is fucking terrifying! Are you kidding? What a scary game. <laughs> I don't care what anyone says. That, that game is terrifying. Alright, let me get let me get this key. So we can go get that chest. It was vile, it was. It was very, very much a spook. Spooked me out, scared me. This portal leads to a special <laughs> place where you can learn to fly. It was the jump scares as well that were really dragon, bad in that, it, that game, right? Learn like, to fly. <laughs> Got it. It was so loud every time that it jump scared you. The game volume increased by like a hundred percent. Horrible. I 
I can't believe that we couldn't complete that game because my game glitched out and I didn't get all the achievements when I was supposed to be getting them. That's incredibly annoying. Oh well, it is what it is. Alright, they've got the flying level now. I've already got that guy. Yeah, sorry about that. I mean, it's not your fault though. Like, how are you supposed to know that the achievements would just bug out and not activate? It was weird. It's a common issue with that game, apparently. Like, it's a bug that happens quite often. It is an indie game, to be fair. So you can't really be bad. <laughs> Spyro! Are you okay? <laughs> he just bumped his head. Dude, why are the flying levels always such a fucking bop? This is obviously not the intended route because I haven't got much time left on it. Oh, yikes. Oh, God, no. I've still got planes to do. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, they're too far away. They're too far away. Okay, I'll do the plane. Do the planes before. Do the planes before. Those guys are running around with the eggs. Piss me off. Yeah. super scuffed out of order now. Like, this is really scuffed now. It's okay, I can actually save this. I can actually save it. I haven't got all the arches though. This is the last one. Okay, I just need to fly to that last box. <laughs> Dude. Oh no, there's two more. It's fine. It's fine. We've got enough time. We've got enough time. It's fine. The most scuffed <laughs> that it's ever been. Amazing. Still did it. Still did it. Whoa, you see Sparrow just like... <laughs> Sparrow suffered brain damage. <laughs> the, dr the music was done by Drummit. Yes. It was done by... I don't know his name. He was the drummer from The Police. Which is really, really bizarre. Like, it's such a weird thing. But hey, it works. I like it. Amazing. Yeah, Stuart Copeland, that's his name. He did all the music for Spyro. That's why it sounds so fucking like... <laughs> so good. Steve? Not Stuart? Oh, sorry. Something Copeland though, right? Rings a bell. Hey, It's your boy! Come on and slam, and welcome to the jam! If you want a jam! Nice. Hey Grim! Thank you so much for the raid! How are you guys? Invaded by Doc and his gremlins. <laughs> we hope that you brought tacos. We do hope that. Welcome in, Grim. Welcome in, Raiders. Thank you so much for the raid. Playing God of War? Oh, yes. Grim is playing God of War at the moment, guys. The new one. No way! I can't believe this! <laughs> the new one. Very good game. All the God of War games are very good. Would recommend. How are you enjoying it, Grim? How are you enjoying your time with it? It 
It's a great game, in my opinion. First time I've been able to raid me? Really? You've raided us before, right? Right? I'm sure you have. I don't know though. Now I don't know. You're making me doubt myself. It feels like you have. I don't know. Eh? What? What are you talking about? <laughs> <clears throat> Just beat it? Damn, you, you smashed out that game super fast. Holy shit. I'm sure you only just started playing it the other day. Well, congrats. How, how did you find it? Bring the speed running. All ready for the sequel, yeah. True. True. I'm excited for the sequel. I probably won't play it on stream because I don't want spoilers. And you just know people are going to come in the stream and be like, oh, by the way, Kratos dies in the end or something like that. And it's like, all right, I don't want that to happen. So I'm just not going to stream it. You just, I just ask you a question. Go on then, ask me a question. I can't promise I'll know the answer to it, but... Greg's or Pret? Greg's. 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 Every day. Silly question. Silly question, really. Always Greg's. A good Greg sausage roll. Ooh. Now I want Greg's. Now I want Greg's, dude. Dad. Good choice. <laughs> Chris gets pegged by Thor. Welcome Trust me, my dad Wizard works at Pits. Nintendo. <laughs> this is my favorite oh, no. spot. Use it to bash those wizards. Yeah, it it's a shame. But when we played Resi 8, um I was so excited for that game. So excited for it, and I was like, you know. Hyping up for ages on stream, I was like, oh, I can't wait, you know, Resident Evil is one of my favorite series of all time. <laughs> and then we, we played on stream, and some fucking little big bitch came in with a raid, and all of the people were spamming spoilers, and I was like, you fucking cunt. So we're not playing any game that I've never played before on stream now that's a big new release, because I'm not, I'm not chancing it. Those Twitch is full of cunts, unfortunately. Sadly. Thank you for the host as well. I don't know if I'm saying your name right, by the way. Is it Jotun? Psychedelic Jotun? And thank you, Digital Me Mech. Digital Mech as well. Wait, no! Wait. You need to go through down both the superchargers for that jump, or else it's not fast enough. on that stream, I'm telling you. The amount of people they had to ban was ridiculous. It's just such a shame that people are like that. You know? Oh god. Oh, I'm kind of make that. I've still got another jump I need to do. Um, so I'm gonna do that now. Just so it's done. I actually did some mod work that stream, I know. It's not very often that we have to get our banning fingers out, is it? 
such a shame, though. I'm gonna play Elden Ring um, when that comes out, like, on release. But I'm not being, like, funny or anything, but I really don't give a shit about story spoilers, so... If somebody comes in and like, oh, by the way, your character dies at the end, I'll be like, oh, I don't, I don't care. <laughs> I don't care, I don't play Souls game for the story anyway. So it wouldn't bother me. So I'm gonna play Elden Ring on release, but I'm not gonna play God of War, Ragnarok. I'm not risking the spoilers on that one. Did I go around the back of that? I hope so. Did I go around the back of that? Oh god, I hope so. And that's why I couldn't stream God of War 2, probably Thank the only game I don't spoiled. Me. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Well, actually, it's a cannon. Well, just don't spoil Spyro for me, please. Spyro dies in the end. <laughs> it was all a dream. It was all a dream in the end. <laughs> Souls games never end good. Yeah, I don't, I don't really care about the story. Like, the only story of any Souls game I've ever played that I've been, like, actually invested in was Bloodborne. Like, I was like, oh, this this is actually quite interesting. <laughs> Other than that, I haven't really cared about the story in Souls much. I just like the gameplay. Ay, 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 ay. <laughs> Thank you, friend. <laughs> the Jojo. Oh, part six. Jojo comes out next month. Guys, I'm excited. I'm excited. It's your girl, Jolene. Jolene, dude. I'm excited. I'm excited. Hey Vector! Hey Vector! Listen carefully, Spyro. Well, I mean, There's if we're counting Sekiro, that had an okay home. story. Yeah, it is Sekiro probably had the Try most jumping on the like artisan home. What a good story of any of them, didn't it? But Sekiro was really not my style of gameplay. Like, I just wasn't enjoying it as much. Personally, it just wasn't for me. Spyro unzips his belly and its knuckles the whole time. Oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. Corvix, that's spoilers. I'm gonna have to unmod you for that one. You silly. Cameron, what's happening here? <laughs> I love the way they say owl. Alright, have I got all the gems here? I have. Last level as well in this world. Sekiro could jump off a rather large bus for all I care. <laughs> I mean... Well, ac well, actually, if if he jumped off a bus, he'd be fine because Sekiro doesn't really have a lot of fall damage. Corvix, <laughs> Sekiro man. Oh, the music in this level, dude! The drums go quite hard in this level. Game so much, so much. It 
it's the hardest last boss I've ever I've ever attempted in any video game and I fucking did it but oh god it was hard like oh it got to the point where I was like I, I nearly cried me, Sparrow. I had tears you have no idea how long I've been trapped in I had crystal. tears in my eyes and, uh, <laughs> do I. who are you again this uh, game takes me way back I'm sheesh <laughs> I am become old yeah I know I feel old as well Anyone gonna be watching the live action Cowboy Bebop? Mm, I'll probably give it a go. Give it a go. I, I'm a huge fan of the anime though, so I'm kind of biased. A lot of trouble getting into my main sentiment was that it was better than Neo. Oh, you see, I fucking love Neo. <laughs> I fucking love Neo. I love the arcadey style of the combat in the game. It's more of like, um, well, I don't I know how to describe it, but it was so much fun to me. I love the gameplay in that game. Very character action game. Loved it. The only thing is the levels are quite, levels are quite repetitive and a bit bland. I never played the second one though, I hope the second one is like a lot better. Ooh, you got me over that. Oh shit. Hell bastard. Dude, I'm not even mad that the music is so loud. I'm not even mad. music loud in the boss levels on purpose because the music is not that loud in any other level <laughs> I appreciate it I appreciate it oh! oh you little bastard just die oh my god okay we're on track we're on track right now we're doing it I like the gameplay new, but I could not skip those cutscenes fast enough. <laughs> Thank you, Spyro, for recovering so many of our dragon eggs. Hop aboard for the Beast Maker's World if you're ready. I will. I love Spyro in the little hot air balloon. Oh, he's so cute. <laughs> he's so cute. I love him. Well, Bab Dragon. So cute. It takes a lot for me to skip cutscenes on my first playthrough. I mean, the story of Neo is just so... It, it's so weird and dumb. Like, <laughs> it actually cracked me up quite a few times. Like, when that fucking guy, that ninja guy, just pulls a cat. He just pulls a cat out of his top at one point. And it's like, what? <laughs> like, okay. So weird. I mean, it's like 25 episodes. Master Nork is turning our swamp into True. an electrified junk heap. And it used to be so beautiful. I'm sure it was. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> K-E-I-D-A. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Thank you so much for the sub, Swinter. I hope that you're having a good day. Oh, 10 months. We're all having Twitch babies right now, aren't we? I'm having Twitch babies with everybody right now. <laughs> that was the best cutscene in the game. Yeah, it, it was quite funny. It cracked me up. I also like the cutscene where William... um, Because he doesn't speak Japanese, right? But he can understand it because of the spirit thing in his brain or whatever. I don't remember exactly, but he could understand Japanese, but he can't speak it. And this guy was just talking Japanese to him about something, and he just he just turns to another character and goes, What the fuck is wrong with this prick? And it's like, you can't say that, William. You can't say that. That's so rude. <laughs> it really cracked me up, though. It's so funny. Like, it really caught me off guard. <laughs> Oh shit, dude! What the fuck? 
Oh my god! <laughs> Guys! <laughs> Guys! What's happening? <laughs> oh shit! Ten! Daniel! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! This is gonna be going on for a bit. <laughs> Holy shit! Whoa! I I don't know. No way! I can't believe this! <laughs> I don't know who Anonymous is, but thank you so much, Anonymous. Whoever you are. Yeah, but this is going to be going off for quite some time. <laughs> We've got so many! Yeah. Oh my god! I can't believe that! I can't believe that! Thank you. Thank you. You didn't have to do that, but yeah. I very much appreciate it. That's awesome. I can, I can, um... I appreciate the fact that you don't want to give your name and that's fine, but thank you very much. I very much appreciate that, that's amazing. <laughs> Best dream ever. <laughs> so much love. So much love. So many- yeah, I know the notification was fucking going for it. So many people that are regulars got it as well, which is really nice. Oh my god. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for that. Football, crazy, chocolate, mad. Grab a power pod, play football with the lad. <laughs> you guys. <laughs> You're going for it. I'm, I'm getting extremely excited. Oh, nice trick. <laughs> <laughs> That's one of my favorites, man. <laughs> nice trick. <laughs> Spyro, please! Bam, bam. <laughs> Watch out, Spyro. The Norks in oh, wow. these parts have discovered the power of electricity. <laughs> Come on, England! Really stinks. Scores of fucking goals! <laughs> oh, man. I can't, get I can't get over that. That anonymous, gifted, very generous person. Wow. It's amazing. That's so amazing. Thank you so much. I'm really happy because loads of people got a sub that are regulars in the stream as well. So that's really, really nice. Oh, bless you, whoever you are, sir or madam. Truly blessed. Yeah, the, the um, football crazy chocolate man. It, it's a classic advert that was on TV. I don't even know how we thought of it, but we were streaming one day and then we started talking about it and I was like, oh my God, I need to have that as jingle because it's such a bop. This level's a bit all over the place, isn't it? I oh no! Oh God. Oh. World Cup next year as well. Ready to spam that bad boy. <laughs> Dude. I don't even like football. <laughs> don't even like it. Good job, Spyro. One day you'll be able so to tell all the dragons about my your whole amazing life. adventure. <laughs> yeah, sure. I think but it was Jay really like that came up with it. Swamp. I think we were talking about commercials that are like secretly bops, and then Jay came up with um, the football crazy one. Scotland would be lucky to qualify. <laughs> I don't know anything about football. I couldn't tell you if England were good or not. I don't know. I think they're alright. I think we're okay. Well, I don't know anything about football, so... 
I'm completely clueless when it comes to the subject. Don't like it, but I did get did get a big exciting. I was just shocked that we got that far, honestly. Oh fuck's sake! I was shocked, shooketh. Let me get these, man. We're pop jam, ulu. <laughs> Your ulu, Rami. Ulu. Was the remaster of this good? Yeah, I think so. I thought they were good. I personally still prefer the PS1 versions just because, you know, nostalgia and also I just feel like they look a bit nicer, personally. Like, I just prefer the, like, blocky PS1 style. I just love PS1 games, man. I'm such a massive simp for PS1. I can't help it. This is my favourite, like, looking generation of games, personally. I love early 3D. I love it. Very much. Alright, don't jump in the pool, don't jump in the pool. Just get the gems. We gotta go around for these other gems. Okay, well I'm gonna need to go up here. Full on bamboozling. <laughs> Remember nearly now on a video explaining why the PS1 warp warped and stuff? Oh dude, we should play Crash 3. Crash Bandicoot Warped! <laughs> My favourite Crash game. I need to play it. Maybe we need that as an alert. The Crash 3 title screen. So good. <laughs> yeah, because like Cortex says at the beginning, doesn't he? Um, developed by Naughty Dog or something like that. So good. I just like it when it screams warped. <laughs> it gets me high. And so I feel about Crash 1 to 3, very humbling, warm and cosy games. Yeah, yeah. The PS1 games are just cosy games for me in general. Really like like just the vibe of them. I don't know, and it's just really satisfying to like 100% games of this era because there wasn't usually like a lot of bullshitting around with like side quests or anything like that. It was just simple. Simple times. Wait a second. I'm missing gems here. Um, did I fly over to that other? Wait. Did I fly over to the, that platform over there? Am I dumb? Did I not? <laughs> I might not have. I might not have, dude. I might have not. Silly. Let me just have a look. Frickin' hell. Frickin' hell. Frickin' fricks. Anyone played Shrek 2? My cousin had Shrek 2. On the PS2, right? I never had it myself. I was on about the angry Naughty Dog. Oh! The... the... Um, Naughty Dog! <laughs> that one? Yeah, it's a good one. Oh, for fuck's sake! I don't think the gems are this way. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, they, they've gotta be. They've gotta be this way. They're created and developed by Naughty Dog! <laughs> I fucking love that. So good. Right, there's nothing in there. That's fine. Got everything up here. There's nothing on top of there. Right. I don't think Sparks has got that thing where he points to where the gems are in this game, has he? I don't think, I don't know. 
right, I got the gems on top of there. Okay, I must be missing some this way then. Got to be missing some from around here. Somewhere around here. It's gonna be right at the beginning, isn't it? Go all the way back. Okay, it's not here. Weird. Sparks was RGB before it was cool. Oh wait! Oh, I am a silly. I'm a silly, I missed that corner. That's them. Yeah, that's everything. That's everything. I'm sorry. I apologize. I apologize. I got I got lost for a second. I think that's because we got all those subs. <laughs> and I was like, ah! like, I couldn't think. I couldn't think. I was too excited. Too hype. Don't blame us. <laughs> I'm blaming you guys. I don't have to admit that I was bad if I blame you. I love these pigs. Like they got little tails and wings. Alright, let's let's do the flying level first. Thank you for the follow, John. John J. Torres. Thank you so much. Hope you're having a great day. Hey, hey, glad to be here. Glad to have you. Spyro, it's great to see you, but I've got to go. <laughs> that dragon's my favorite. Oh! Oh shit! We've got like a million things happening at once. Whoa! Go on and slam. And welcome to the jam. Welcome in. Welcome in, everybody. Thank you so much for the rain. What were you playing? The messenger. Is the game too loud, by the way? Or is it alright? Oh my god. <laughs> the messenger. Is that an indie game? Is that an indie game? It rings a bell. That's the one you're working on right now. Ah. That's where I know it from. Woo! Yeah, baby! <laughs> That's what I've been waiting for. That's what it's all about. Woo! <laughs> Crash, but that's fine. We can say hi to everybody. Hi, hi. I hope that you enjoyed playing the messenger, Mojo. I hope you had a good stream. Thank you so much for the raid. Sparrow is my most recent PS One pickup, actually. Nice, nice. PS One games are my fave. My fave. It's a funny game. Only had a short break at work, back at it. I hope that work goes well, Louise. I hope it goes fast for you. Oh my god, my phone is now going off. It is an indie game. Yeah, I thought so. I thought so. Thanks for giving me company while I work, no worries. Oh my god, that, that Bulbasaur is so cute. Look at him. <laughs> Look at him, he's so cute. Platformer beats him up with Ninja Gaiden influences. That sounds really cool. That sounds really cool. Alright, I'm gonna go for boats first, I think. This is probably not a good idea. Ah! Okay, 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 okay. I'm not sure which way to go first on, on this level. I always get confused with this level. Like, do I go boats? Do I go chests first? I never know. Oh, fucking missed him, mate. Where is he, dude? There he is. Where's, where's the boat? Oh, it's there. I didn't, I'm 
fucking this up. I'm s this is scuffed. This is so scuffed. It's fine. We got all the boats, it's fine. We just need all the chests. And I think there's planes as well. I think. Yeah. Planes. the other way i would have got him i would have got him man what that emote the emote's so cute the bulbasaur very adorable there is too much snow outside it's snow where you are grim no way hasn't snowed here yet doing well mojo doing well i know i'm a scrub i'm a scrub winter i know i know doing good though Batteries low, gonna have to dash. No worries, Sophie. I hope you have a great rest of the day. Maybe we'll see you next time. Okay, don't... Don't mess up the boats this time. Okay, well I didn't mess up the boats this time. Yeah, I'm, I'm doing, I'm doing well, Mojo. I hope that you're doing good, too. level is horrible <laughs> fucking did it fucking did it is this game too loud by the way like i cranked it up really high because the music's so good what if it is too loud i can turn it down you're gonna go get dinner i hope they have delicious dinner mojo it's a bit loud yeah i thought so i did think when i was playing that level it might be a bit too loud I've turned it down a smidge. Misty bog. Misty bog. This isn't this isn't the um This isn't the hard one that I used to struggle with when I was a kid. I didn't miss any comments today. I don't think so. This one's got the horrible frogs in it, hasn't it? They're just really OP for no reason. Oh! This is another one of those levels that I used to be scared of. <laughs> Back with your dinner? What, what have you got for your dinner, Mojo? Yeah, like, the plants used to freak me out, and the, the frogs. The frogs aren't scary looking, but they are so... Ah! Like these things, these things. Like, the range on them is crazy for some reason. Spanish omelette. Oh, it sounds delicious. Sounds delicious. I don't know what I'm gonna eat for my dinner. I don't know. Or my tea. 
I'm not sure. Like, usually after stream, I, I can't be bothered to cook anything, so I'll just have something light before I go to bed, kind of thing. Be on the lookout for attack frogs. Attack They're frogs. They're cold blooded killers. Attack frogs? And this used to be such a nice swamp. It was already made so I don't have to cook, yeah. I mean, that's that's such a good idea. I should start doing that. I should start prepping meals so I don't have to cook. Just in the morning, get up, and then just make all of my meals for the day. Put them all in containers. Wow! What's a good jump? <laughs> Amazing jump by me. Miss everything a level. Okay. I need this health. Right, I'm gonna get this way first. You and Corbett said slow. Cooked Irish lamb stew. Oh my god. Sounds so tasty. I want that. I'm gonna try and cook some corned beef. Oh, that sounds nice as well. Everybody in the stream makes me hungry. You're always eating nice things <laughs> that I like. Zeke. Thank you for releasing me. Thank you for releasing me. I can't do Scottish accent. Ah! Oh, you fucking pig. You fucking pig. I've got no sparks again. Great. Oof. No! Oh, it's very obnoxious to pick up every gem. Is the pig coming? I need a health. I need a health. Is what I need. Oh lord. He's coming. He's coming now. He will. Come on. Oh, it, it's actually so it's it's so different to have to pick up all the gems, man. It's, it makes the gameplay so different. My standard is I cook lasagnas in batches. Makes sense. I like lasagna. I haven't cooked a lasagna in ages. Very long time since I cooked a lasagna. I'll tell you what to do Hold with in. those creatures. Smash them, Spyro! Stamp them out and squish them and squash them! <laughs> uh, is this the guy that sounds really them hot them. in the remaster? Is this the guy, maybe? I don't know. It might be that guy. Oh. I mean, what? Guys. It's a dragon. Calm down. <laughs> we also had a free cost earlier. What? We ordered one anyway, but they fucked up and gave us someone else's order so two, so I got two extra toasties. What? And an extra coffee? Oh, what? Why do I never get the free things? Whenever I order something, they never give me anything extra, and sometimes they just leave things out of the order. It's like, alright, it's good. Oh, I missed that. Oh, no, no, I've got it. I've got it. So you double caffeinated then. I missed one, I'm sure. Yeah. He does not accept it. It is scaly. It's not my fault that the dragons are really hot in the remake. It's not my fault. They made them that way. 
I made them that way. It's not. It's not my fault. Okay. I've got nothing else to say about it. Not my fault. <laughs> I'm gonna save this just in case I die. I don't want to go back to the um, the other dragon save. When am I gonna get sparks back? Where are all the chickens at? Oh no, not the frogs. Not the frogs though. I'd have been furious if it was me on the other side. They just didn't get the coffee. <laughs> yeah. Ah, oof, I knew it. I knew I'd die. I knew it. It was just a matter of time, wasn't it? That's fine. Oh, and now there's a chicken there. Now there's a chicken there. Absolutely fine. Yeah, I saw Corpus and didn't get the morning coffee. Don't talk to me before I've had my morning coffee. Don't talk to me. Ah! Oh god, it's the, it's the hell! It's the room! It's the room! Oh no, it's the room! It's the room! It's the room! This is the room. The bane of my childhood, this room. Look at it. Look at that fucking room, dude. Oh, uh, what a nightmare. No! Don't do it! Don't do it! Uh, oh, I don't like it! Too many frogs! Okay, I'm gonna get the frogs before I get the guys. Because they are the worst. Oh, you see? He went for me! He went for me, that guy! Oh. Oh. Insomniac just being like... Pulling the enemies in this room. It seems like I've been <laughs> trapped in here since I was your age. No, no. Oh, Why, no. I remember. Uh, gotta go. Gotta go. All right. I think after this level, we need to have a wee break, small wee break. Because I'm kind of fidgeting. Because I need a wee. I do need a wee. A poo break. <laughs> All right, I'll leave you with um. Okay, I'll I'll leave you with. I was gonna say I'll leave you with the music, but you can hear the pick. So I will leave you with another song, and I'll be I'll be having a quick wee break. <laughs> be right back.
I'm back. I was waiting for the song to end because I like it. <laughs> I was bopping. I was bopping out. Good. Hi back. I'm Steven. Uh, the dad jokes. Oh. <laughs> Good poo. I mean, if you can poo in that amount of time, it's pretty impressive. Right? The fastest poo in the West. But no, <laughs> it wasn't a poo. <laughs> Why is poo such a funny word? Poo. Right, it's the level. It's the level. Oh, treetops. Treetops. Oh, no. It's the level. Rapid fire speed shitting. <laughs> Why are we talking about poo every stream, guys? You guys are children. Very childish. <laughs> Okay, good. Now show me this bullshit, please. Okay, okay, okay. Well, I mean, we need to get to the, the speed ramp first, but... I mean, I've got to try and do it. Oh, God. I really dislike... the jumps in this level. It's quite frustrating. a bad song on this game. Alright. Finish off. Whoa! 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 Finish off this way first and then we'll do the speed ramp for the dreaded speed ramp. Spyro, if you jump at the end of a supercharged ramp, you can really go far. I'm all over it. <laughs> you can really go far. I'm all over it. All right, it's not this ramp I'm talking about. Um, it's not this one. Ah! It's the other one. Going to regret this dinner soon. <laughs> Are you going to need a poop? <laughs> oh, oh god. Okay. Too much food. <laughs> All right. Don't don't leave. Don't leave the level. Sometimes I do that. Like, I just leave the level randomly and I'm like, why did I just do that? It's very silly of me. Right. Nope. Alright, where are we flying? We're flying this way. Now. I think this level is just, it's, it's very large, isn't it? Like, it's, it's very all over the place. It's tough to know where you've been, I think, is the issue. All right. 
gonna do this jump first and then we'll go over do the other one. I think this one you just have to follow the path. Did I save at this? If I die, I want to spawn here, so... Okay. Alright, I'm pretty sure you go over to this one. Uh, yeah, and then you go over this one. There we go, okay, okay. So that's the phase jump. That jump is fine because it's, you know, it's obvious to know where you're supposed to go because it's all in like, kind of a line. It's the next one that really confuses me. That guy over there. Did I kill that guy? You hate this long. Yeah, I used to hate it when I was a kid. I don't mind it so much now, but... Yeah. This level is like a hundred times harder in the remake. For some reason. They've messed, they've messed something up somewhere. It's like really hard to make the jumps. Is this way. Wait, 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 wait. This way for the other jump. Harder in the remake? Yeah, I, I thought it was harder to make jumps in the remake for some reason. Like, I just felt like I, I wasn't getting enough height. Greetings, Spyro. When I did For it an glide. amazing tour of the treetops. Don't just stop at one supercharge. <sighs> But I don't know if anybody else had that issue or not. Might just have been me. But I don't have any issues in this game of making a glide. But I was struggling to make glides on just the normal levels in the remake sometimes and it was like... Huh. Something weird. Okay, so we don't do anything with that jump yet. Because I want to go over here first. Remember it being a little precise in the remake? Yeah, it, it did feel like... Sparrow's movement was like... Not as... Yeah, it, it, was, it was weird. It was weird, like, yeah, what Lily says, a bit slippy. Slippy slidey. Okay, I don't think that we go anywhere with this ramp. Oh, well, I just fell off anyway. Um... <laughs> that's fine. Um... I'm just going to double check, but I don't think that ramp goes anywhere. <laughs> it's a good thing I got loads of lives, isn't it? Right, I'm not, I don't think this ramp goes anywhere, but I'm going to check anyway. Oh, it does. Oh, I went too far. Look at that, dude! I went so high! <laughs> okay. You know what it is? I think it was the double charge. It was the double charge. Too speedy. Too much speed. There we go. <laughs> That's not the bullshit jump, by the way. That jump's fine. Alright, he's done. I'm just gonna kill myself just so I respawn. Hit that dragon because it's easier. Alright, this is the bullshit jump that I hate, but I'm pretty sure it's way easier now because I know exactly how to do it. So you, you have to turn yourself all the way around and go up. What's where's the ramp? Yeah, you have to go up this little ramp here. You have to go up that. You have to like do it 360 in the air. I missed it. <laughs> I missed it.
Okay, uh, yeah, I didn't turn around. Uh, you, you need to uh, fall big boy soon. Fall big boy soon. Further than that. All the way around. That's it. You don't need to do anything else. You just need to go all the way around. Go up that one. You don't have to even go up any of the other ramps in the level. You just do that and then you get to this. <laughs> what? I know! We've been doing it wrong all these years. That was quite a ride, Spyro. You've learned a lot since you were a young glider. Because usually yeah. you have to go on like loads of different ones and then stuck. you end up on that one after, but you can just do a full tier in the air and then get there faster. Like, it's way easier to do it that way. It's fucking crazy town. Crazy town. <laughs> My whole life is a lie! I know. Whoa! Barry, okay. Took me so long to figure that out. I know. That was one of the levels as, as a kid that I would always just not 100%. Like, I'd just leave that one because I could never figure it out. Level somewhere. Somewhere I've missed a level. I think. Oh no, I haven't. I haven't. I'm talking shit. This is the boss level. Oof. Usually the boss levels don't have um, like little critters in that have the health, but this one does. Um, excuse me. I don't know if that's intentional or not. Or they just forgot. I don't know. big robot is all charged up to meet you. Attacking the power pole should disrupt its power supply. I'm not sure what to stream, what to stream. Ooh. We have to play Jack and Daxter at some point this month. Some point. It's Jack month apparently. Apparently. Which is cool. Whoa! I could always play that. 
tomorrow. If you guys are up for that. Jack month? Yeah, apparently so. I saw on Twitter that it it's Jack month this month. It's been like so many years since the original release, which is cool. So I feel like we should play Jack. Jack and Daxter. I love that game. So good. We could always play that tomorrow or we could play something else. It's up to you guys. Would you guys be up for that or... Want something a bit different? Hey, where's the key, dude? Oh, you know what? I've got the fucking key, haven't I? Like a silly, like a silly, silly sausage. Wait a second. Who get the key? I am a silly sometimes. Sounds good. Oh, I need to beat the boss before I leave. Really? Oh. Oh. Maybe I just kill myself. I just kill myself, dude. I just kill myself and this is fine. Alright. Faster. The key's over here, I forgot. Forgot to get it. Um down here, I think. Oh. Oh, wait. Do you want to see Jack and Daxter Grimm? <laughs> There's the key. No! Oh! That was the shittest glide of all time. I don't even know how I managed to do that. I wanted to ask you guys as well. Are there any like video games that are like very like retro video games that are very Christmassy? Because it might be nice to play some kind of Christmassy type of games around December time. But I can't think of anything personally. It doesn't have to be like an actual Christmas game, it can just be set around Christmas or just, you know, vibes of being Christmas. I don't know. Ah, oof! Oh my god! My dude! Are you kidding? No! Oh, silly. Oh no! Very silly! Very silly sausage. Why? Why would I do that to myself? Did it just drop a gem? Where's a gem? Lemmings? <laughs> I, I, I don't think I've ever played lemmings. That sounds weird, but I don't think I've ever played lemmings. Christmas nights. It's not Christmas until night says it's Christmas. You could play Christmas nights. I've never played nights before. It looks weird. Oh, oof. Oh lord, he's eating these guys at me. I will be really careful now! Oh, I'm dead. Never mind. Okay. <laughs> oh, I'm too... I'm too greedy. I'm too greedy. Oh my god. What 
we talked about? I was getting hot chocolate. We're talking about any kind of Christmas themed retro games that you guys know about. Anything Christmassy. But Christmas nights is a good is a good is a good one. A good shout. I don't know if I'd be very good at nights. It seems extremely strange. I don't really know what the gameplay like loop is to it. It, it just seems like you're flying through rings. I, I don't really know. I'd say is I haven't really played it much. Got Jet Set, is that Jet Set Radio? I haven't played that game. I think I would like to play it though, it looks cool. Very stylish. One of your favorite games ever, nice. Um, I need to get this chest up here before I forget. <laughs> Looks like they're all names ready. Robocard, Christmas Nights, Christmas Lemons. I think there's a mediocre one on the SNES where you play as Father Christmas. <laughs> oh my god. Lily should play that. <laughs> Designated rubbish game player, Lily. No! Ah. Back in five ticks. It's already been five ticks. It's already been five ticks. Is that it? Good. Good. Days before Christmas, don't remember it being great. <laughs> you better go. Yeah, Lily, Lily plays the bad games. <laughs> she, she takes one for the team. All right, I think. Let me just double check before I go. I've got everything in this game so far, right? Yeah, good. I feel so much better now that so many dragons have been rescued. Thank you, Har Haru. Oh. <laughs> oh. You never played the Mr. Blobby game? Oh god, Mr. Blobby, terrifying. Terrifying creature. Mr. Blobby. <laughs> Hate him. This is my favourite. This is my favourite home world. I love it very much. <laughs> I love the noises those guys make. <laughs> That's funny. I swear, things like that really make me laugh for some reason. Ah! Yes! Alright, I'm pretty sure this this level's got like absolute fucking banger of a, of a song. Are you playing Robocod for Christmas then? I don't know, it's on the wheel currently, but I can take it off the wheel and put something else on there. And then that can be, just be like a Christmas game instead, maybe? I don't know. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll take it off the wheel and then... If it's a Christmassy game, I didn't realise it was a Christmassy game. Is it? Are you on about the, the, the first one or the, the second one? Because I've currently got the second one on the wheel right now. Stop interrupting the music. 
the enemies here can be quite frightening. The enemies but here. To support the fool. <laughs> I'd rather blame the fools. Now, now you're, you're thinking. thinking. Now you're thinking. Now you're thinking. <laughs> All the way he says that. Oh no, these things just to scare me as well. Look at them. Oh, disgusting. Horrible. Horrible things. Welcome back, Cine. Now you're thinking. <laughs> hey, and these dogs as well. This is one of my most feared levels as a child. Very terrifying. Look at them. Do 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 do. Oof! You still got me though, didn't you? You little bastard. Robocod, oh, is the second one. It's not. Thank you for releasing me. Thank you for releasing me. <laughs> that's the that's the J Dragon. That's the J Dragon. No! Oh God! Oh, no! Spook! Spook! Very spook! It's not very Christmassy, to be honest. Mainly just the intro and the end. Ah, oh, well, I don't know then. Fuck it. know this game? Cthulhu saves Christmas? <laughs> Sounds amazing. Sounds amazing. Is it an indie game? <laughs> yeah. Did they remove all the penguin biscuits from the Mega Drive version? That's a shame. <laughs> what do you mean? Penguin biscuits? Oh, fuck it, hell! Oh, fuck it then. Die then. Guess I'll die. <laughs> it's alright, I'm just. I'm doing it on purpose because I like the music of this level so much. That, that's why. That's why I'm, I'm taking my ages. That, that's why I keep getting hit all the time. That's the only reason. I swear. There's no other reason for it. Promise. You fucking bitch! Are you joking? Oh, there's sparks. Damn it. You know, I think you just might be the dragon to defeat Nasty Nork. That's me, all right. That's me, all right. <laughs> That's me, all right. All right, where's that gap I'm gonna fly down to? Where is it? There. Oh God, I need a little. A little critter. Do 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 do. I could be a voice actor, man. I could be a voice actor. I'm gonna voice act Spyro. That's what I'm gonna do. Watch this space. I'm the next Spyro voice actor. Me. Oh, just kill me. Just kill me, dude. There's no point in even 
trying to save myself because that's right at the beginning of the level. Silly. <laughs> I am being silly now. I'm being very silly now. Where's the fucking... There it is. Jazz Jack Rapid, Rabid Christmas? <laughs> Did they ever tell you about the guy who voiced Abe? What's his name? Guys! Lor Lawrence Lennon? Is that his name? The Precious Man? The Precious Precious Man? That made Abe? He voices Abe, right? As well. Maybe. I think. I think so. He's very precious and adorable, that man. Is that his name? Lorne Lanning? Something like that. Something like that, man. Yeah, that's right. Can't remember. Oh, you were 18. I'm sure that's his name. Okay, take care of that. Uh, nope. Hopping off, dude. He's precious. Precious man. I don't know, I just find him so adorable. Thanks, Spyro. Thanks. I'd love to help you catch Nasty, but I'd really hate being trapped in Crystal again. Don't worry, the only one who's gonna be trapped is him. <laughs> the only one who's gonna be trapped is him. the song goes hard goes hard this is gonna be one of the best songs in the game in my opinion Thank you for releasing me. <laughs> uh, I don't know why it cracks me up so much. <laughs> Thank you for releasing me. I can't do the accent. I can't do the accent, dude. I try, I try, and I try. I can't do it. Too hard. I can't do any accents. Sad. Oof. Oh no. Oh no, I missed the, I missed the turtle. Oh god, oh god. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Uh, oh. That room's a bit of a nightmare. They had them very... placed out in a very cruel way. There's better be all the gems that are left. A. A. The skybox. Oh, oh, so nice. I like I like purple in general as like a color. So that's really nice. Oh no. <laughs> Chicken burgers in the oven? Oh, I want chicken. I want chicken burger. I want chicken burger. I 
Maybe I order food after the stream. Maybe that's what I do. I don't know. I'll take away places closed early on Sundays. Welcome to the dream weavers, young one. While chasing nasty's minions in this world, you must expect I don't know. the unexpected. Chicken bacon disaster. <laughs> southern fried chicken. I love southern fried chicken. I love just the southern fried chicken that you put in the oven, like you know, just the um, the ones that you get from Tesco. Oh my god, they're so delicious. There's this one chicken steak that I like buying from Tesco, and it's like um, it's like a chili chicken southern fried one. So it's like a bit spicy. It's so nice, so delicious. At this time you might have to settle for a sweaty kebab. Can't go wrong with a sweaty kebab though, can you really? Can't go wrong. I had pineapple and ham, zaw? Pizza? You mean? <laughs> zaw? Grim, what are you talking about? You better not be putting pineapple on your pizza or else I'll be very upset. How could you keep doing this to me? Taka had a pineapple, having pineapple pizza the other day. I was disgusted. I was disgusted by it. It's okay, you put it on Zaw. <laughs> what Zaw? <laughs> He's not gonna reply, is he? He's not gonna say. He's just gonna leave us hanging on that. But what is it? What is it, though? You're stressing me out, dude. <laughs> Chaos. Chaos. Howdy. I hope everyone's having a wonderful night so far. Doing well. Doing good. You know me. I'm always having a good time. I'm always having a good time when I'm with you guys. Because <laughs> I love you guys. What's the problem with ham and pineapple? Jay. Fairies are always on your side, Spyro. Thanks for that. <laughs> That guy loves fairies. All right, remember that's the, the key for that. Remember to go back. I'll remember, I'll remember that. I kind of, I kind of knew this game like quite well. Luckily, doesn't mean I'm, you know, any good at it. But I would say I'm. I know this game. Whoa, one, a one gem on that box. Weird. Thank you for the lake, Joseph. Appreciate it. Hope that you are having a great day. This way first, and then um, we'll do all of this side. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll we'll do this over this way, and then we'll go up the the ramp after. Thank team. you for releasing me. That is very, very nice color scheme. He had pink horns. Very nice. This this music's nice. This music's like it, it's it's more of a vibe, right? It's more of a vibe. Do, 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 do. 
Alright, where does that whirlwind go, do you reckon? Over there. Is it worth going up the tower first? Yeah. I don't know which way is the better way to go, but we'll go this way first. We're gonna have to go both ways anyway. a broken record but I, I love the colour scheme in this game. It's like aesthetic. Aesthetic. You know? No! You horrible thing. I love this game. I've beaten it numerous times. Got the platinum trophy in all three games and reignited. For me, like, oh, I've done it again. I've done it again, dude. I missed the fucking thing. For me, I platinum the first and the second game, but then didn't bother with the third one because I never played the third one growing up. Oh. So I had no, like I've got no nostalgia for it. And when I tried to play it, I was like, oh, I don't like the gameplay loop of that game very much. Like there's loads of mini games and you have to play as those other characters, which I really don't like. Like the kangaroo and the penguin and everything, it's just like, oh, I don't, I don't want to play as those characters, to be honest. <clears throat> ah, Spyro. Gonna get my beagers while you go round and round the tower, we'll thank you, Jay. New places here in Lofty Castle, <laughs> See where it takes you. Third one is the only one that you like? Really? Really? See, I prefer the first one the most because it's just the most simple one out of the bunch. Like, it's just... It's just nice, you know? Just very... Oh, ooh, dude, I fucking saved that. I fucking saved that. That's why you're not into it. I can understand. Like the third, the second one and the third one have got a lot more like going on, and um, lots of different mini games, gameplay styles, and all that kind of stuff. But for me, I just don't, I just don't enjoy it as as much personally. I, I just prefer it when it's just a straight up collectathon. That's just me though. Hey, Carnage, and hey. Malbec. Great classic. It is a great classic. Such a good game. Very much enjoy it. Yeah, I hope that you're having a good day, Carnage and Malbec. All night, depending on your time zone. I know it's it's um it's how early in the morning is it in Australia right now? How early is it? It's currently, what, half past ten at night here. So it's half past nine in the morning, yeah. Not super early then, not, not ridiculously early. I would say, God, I've missed, like, your last two streams because I've been asleep. <laughs> I've just been asleep both times. I'm gonna start forcing myself to get out of bed earlier in the mornings. like I played Mario 64 and I was like expecting to really like it and then I just didn't enjoy it very much but when I played Banjo 
Like, people were like, oh, well, if you didn't like Mario 64, then you're not going to like Banjo either. But I like Banjo more for some reason. Like, I didn't want to carry on with Mario 64 because I just wasn't enjoying it. But I genuinely really like Banjo a lot, which is weird. <clears throat> I guess one of the things I really dislike about Mario 64 as well is like every time that you get a star it boots you out the level and it's like well, I, I wish you could just go through the level and collect all the stars all in one big chunk I don't like having to restart the level every time but that's just me Mario 64 gets a lot better the more you master controls. Yeah, I, I've heard that it's quite tight control-wise. It just wasn't something that really... Like, hooked me, I guess. Which is fine. I'm glad that I gave it a go. I'm always up for trying games I haven't played. Definitely one area where Jambo improved on the formula as well as the humour and the control with the glide. Yeah, maybe it's just that Banjo is a bit more forgiving, possibly. And that's why I kind of gelled with it a bit more. Does this guy make that one go up? Yeah, I don't want to go this way. Not yet. We got the way! Horrible thing. Quick! Hurry up! I'll go back for that. Go back for that gem. We were making bets what time you'd wake you might wake up me. during my stream. <laughs> Give me a break. It was my it was my last day of work. Um, yesterday so I went to bed super late and then woke up super late as like a treat as a treat very very exciting <laughs> it's the little things in life googly eyes on everything yeah and banjo <laughs> yeah Rare have certainly got a very um, interesting art style. Oh, I didn't do that very well, did I? That's too low. Oh, all right, it's too high that time. <laughs> I'll do. I'll do this. It's just gonna, you know, take me, take me a couple. There we go. Oh god. It's fine. Expirited Spyro. Expirited Spyro over here! <laughs> the best at Spyro. It's me. There we go. Jesus Christ. Got there eventually. All right, is that just the dragon? Yeah. Good lord. Banjo is more forgiving, but over time that makes me like Mario more because of a lot more risk factor. I mean, I, I like watching people do like speed runs and stuff on Mario 64. Because it's like super cool to see all of like the different movement tech in that game. It's absolutely insane. But for me personally, I can't pull any of that kind of stuff off, so... <laughs> but it's still fun to watch. Like, it's got a very high, um... What's it called? Like a, like a high skill ceiling? Is that what it's called? When you can get really good at the game. I guess we just go back. that gifted me a sub thanks we don't know it was it was anonymous it was a, a anonymous person 
Very kind. Very kind. Oh no. <laughs> I should have just glided all the way back. And Dramora as well. Yeah, I was saying like a lot of uh, regulars got it, which is really, really nice. Very cool. The mysterious man slash woman, we will never know. We will never know, but they will live on in our hearts. As a legend. Oh. I do need to get that gem. Oh, am I gonna have to go all the way around? No way. Wait. No, thank god. Thank god. I was gonna say, I don't wanna go all the way back around for that. This level's got quite a lot of tight jumps, like glides. Hey, gems. like got the spyro main theme in as well so i like the song a lot all right this guy is right on the edge so he's a bit awkward you're a bit awkward there my dude The strangest question that I've ever asked on stream, <laughs> probably. What is everybody's favorite gem color <laughs> in this game? What's everybody's favorite gem color? I love the pink one, like the purpley pink one is my favorite. <laughs> I know it's such a weird question, but I think that I keep singing this game's praises on its art direction, but I really do love. The color palette in this game. I think it's very strong. Very, very strong. Pink too. Green. Blue. We've got a lot of um, color lovers in the chat today. Hey guys, you guys like colors? Any color enjoyers? <laughs> I apologize. It's the silliest question I've ever asked. I do. Any advice before this battle? battle. Advice. Hmm. A wise dragon once told me, aim high in life, but watch out for flying boxes. Huh? Huh? <laughs> I love that Spyro face he does. That expression. Um, you little shit. How dare you. Red. Everybody likes a different color. Oh my god. <laughs> This, this guy is fucking me up! Stop it! Stop it now! <laughs> oh my god. Now someone just has to say yellow and we have the full set of Power Rangers. Or a black. Sparks. Give me that. Oh god. Nice. Thank god. Red, but I'd say yellow for more of a point value. Yeah, I mean the the pinky purple ones. I don't know if it's pink or purple. It looks more pink to me, personally. But those ones are the, the, the highest, aren't they? They're 25 value. Which is nice. Oh, God! <laughs> are you speedrunning the game? <laughs> Absolutely not. Absolutely not. 
As you can see. As you can see. But I do like this game a lot. I would never speedrun this game though. It, it's actually insane. Watching people speedrun this. It's an experience, I can say that. All right, we just did that one. See, I've already forgot which way I'm going. The best answer is the one with the highest value. The 25 one then. Which is pink. That looks, that's not looks like PS1 version. It's um, on an emulator, that's why. It might look a bit, a bit more crisp. Um, mate. Tell me. No! Uh, went too far. Good. Sometimes it feels speedrun. Speedrun stale the fun out of a game because it feels more like a chore. I mean. I enjoy watching speedruns. I enjoy watching them. I wouldn't personally don't think do it myself just because I don't have like the extreme amount of patience that you need to have. You know? I mean, I'd give it a go, but I wouldn't ever probably go for like, oh, I'm gonna try and get world record on this game. It'd just be for fun. Just to see how fast I could personally do it. It wouldn't be for glory, is what I mean. Just for fun. Any games you might want to speed up? If I was doing a game, I'd probably do Resi Remake. Resi 1 Remake. Like the remaster. That's, that's, that's a good, that's a good speed game. Be like me and be a speedrunner on like second go. <laughs> Absolutely not. I'm not all good at all. Oh, I've already fucked it. I missed that chest. I'm saying I feel the act of doing the speedrun takes the fun out of it. I, I don't know. It must feel good to have like a mastery of, of a game though. Like it must feel like fucking good to know that you're really good at a game. Okay, I missed. Are you fucking kidding me? It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> As you can see. No, I did it again! I did it again! I missed the box again! I forgot. Immediately. That's what I mean. I've got two second memory. I 
extra stress, especially being recorded doing it. I think that's the thing. Like that, that kind of happened to me. I tried to do, no, I don't want to do it again, dude. Just, 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 no, just quit. <laughs> Like, I, I, I tried to play Resident Evil Remake to see how fast I could do it, and I can't do it on stream because the pressure's too high. <laughs> the pressure's too high, I was just fucking up on stuff that I don't usually fuck up on, and it was just... It just was just embarrassing, so... Yeah. Not great. Working RAM. Yeah, that's me. Do I have to put this on that other guy again? I do. It's went in a level, I guess. There was a guy that was about to get a world record for Dog Kong 64 and he missed the last Nicely hit. Nicely done. Uh, I'll be done when I toasted that nasty nork. Oh god. I would see the thing is if you're speedrunning, you have to just accept that. Like you have to just be like, oh well, you know, shit happens, we'll get it next time. But for me, I'd be like, no! I'd like I'd be distraught. I'd be distraught. I'd be so upset and probably really fucking mad as well. And I like I haven't got I haven't got it the, the um I haven't got the patience for that man. I don't think I could cope. If I was that close to something and then it was just taken away from me, I'd be like, oh you know what? That's fucking bullshit. <laughs> The fools you see in this world. The fools you see in this world. But that does not mean they shouldn't be attacked. Onion rings. I want onion Sounds rings. Right to me. Uh, guys, so I'm so hungry. You guys are making me hungry right now. Woohoo! Alright, we've got haunted towers there. I need to go up there as well. I think this should be the last gem. Okay, that's the last gem. Yes, and this is the last level now, I think. Hey, Paz! <laughs> Why is that popcorn squirrel so cute? Why is it so cute? Adorable. I'd die if that happened, yeah. I'd just be like, I'm done, I'm fucking done. <laughs> And you can't be like that. You can't be like that if you're a speedrunner. You just gotta be like, shit happens. We'll try again tomorrow. They got f more fucking patience than me, I can tell you that. Order the food. I'll order the food after stream. Don't worry. Dun, 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 dun. This one's got some good fucking bass in it. How's it been going? Not going too bad. Not going too bad. Paz, how are you? I hope that you're doing well. Did I get the one? Thank you, Dramora. <laughs> Give me all the details. What are you ordering? I don't know. I don't know. I'm doing it after the stream. <laughs> I don't know. I'll just see whatever's open. Probably be like a kebab. Because that'll be the only place open. It's like either a doner kebab or like a big, a fat greasy cheese big. Whatever it'll be, it'll be greasy. No! Oh, fucking hell. It's alright. 
I think I can reach this guy with the... Um, I don't know, actually. I think I can. I can, I can reach that guy with the, the other fairy, I think. On the other side. <laughs> hey Spyro, all dragons know there's magic in a fairy's kiss. See what it can do to your power of flame. Fairy's kiss, huh? 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 Why is there no female dragons, by the way? Why is there no... Where's the no female ones? No! Stop it. That's the question. And why is Sparrow so low? Why are all the other dragons stand on their hind legs and why does he crawl on the floor on all fours? What's the Spyro lore? <laughs> What's the Spyro lore, dude? They reproduce like snails? Oh no. That's a horrible thought. I like snails though. Because of males are the best. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Sure, Jay. No! Oh, little bastard. Little bastard! How's it going, dragon fans? Any Spyro of the dragon fans in chat? <laughs> Any Spyro fans? Hey, Jose. that his scaly fantasy might be crushed because the dragons might mate with each other like snails. I, I'm not a scaly. So number one, I'm not a scaly. Number one. Number two, they don't mate like snails because I've seen, I've seen art <laughs> that says otherwise. So I don't know what you're talking about. And also there's a website. Hold your horns. Here comes There's a website spiral. called Bad Dragon. And I didn't find that, Lily found that, so you can blame Lily for that one. Lily found that website. So, I don't know, man. I don't know. Maybe I'm not the scaly, maybe it's Lily. Maybe Lily was the scaly all along. Can't blame me for that one. Jesus. <laughs> I recommend everybody to Google um, Bad Dragon. I recommend it. And then tell me what your favorite one is. <laughs> oh my god, are you giving Dragon Porn website shout outs on live? Yes. Yes. That's what that's what it's come to. That's what it's actually come to. That's my life now. There's no point in even denying it because you guys won't believe me anyway. So I may as well just embrace the fact that I'm Piv. I may as well just embrace it. I'm not scaly, I read a dragon porn website. <laughs> it's not porn, but yeah, it's not porn, it's it's items. How many variants of the fairy are there? What do you call someone who's into mollusks? Oh god, now you're asking, I don't know. I know that there's fairies that like animals that are mammals, maybe? Or maybe it's just things that have got fear, I don't know. And then there's scalies that like things with scales. So, dragons or lizards. I guess? Anything that has scales? Fuck! 
Sucky. The question is, the question is, do scalies have a scale sona? Or is it still called a fissona? Because it's technically not theory. But it's in, it, but it, it is theory at the same time, but, but it's not. I don't, I don't know. I'm confused by this whole thing. I'm very confused. Somebody explain it to me. Somebody explain it to me in detail. <laughs> like I'm five. Well, yes, that side caters to a specific you dragon related product. Great work. Great work. Can you be a spidery? Oh, God, spiders. Disgusting. Gross. I hate spiders, man. I don't like them. I don't think I've done this fast enough. Absolutely not. Yeah, dude! Fuck you! Bitch. Nice. And this fairy gives us, gives us um, infinite fire breath. Which is very nice, isn't it? Now we are Red Spyro. down that whole way. There's a chest here. I always forget that chest and I didn't this time. Thank god. Thing is, thing I hate is in games when there's a spider woman the top half is a hot girl but the rest is a spider. Yeah, disgusting. It's like, oh it's hot. But it's a spider, so it's not hot. But it's still hot because it's a babe. It's a babe, but it's a no from me. It's gonna be a no from me. Oh, excuse me. You prefer a spider torso with a lady part on the bottom? <laughs> no, I don't want any spider parts, thank you. <laughs> Just want a normal lady, that's no fun. Weirdo answers only. <clears throat> it's too many, it's too many um hot babe monsters. That's the thing. It's not our fault. So like you can't blame you can't blame us for being weirdos though, because the video games made us this way. It's not our fault. What are we supposed to do? Did it. Maybe a spider lady in Dark Souls if she puts a sheet over it. I mean, she's a bit of a babe. She, she's a bit of a babe, but she, she's also... She's kind of like a crab spider, isn't she? Like, she's super gross. What's her name? Quailog? Quay, Quailog? Something like that. I prefer her sister, who's a cutie, that you give the humanity to. She, she is, she's very cute. Yeah, Quay, Quay Long. That's the name. Where's the balloonist? He's up there. He's up there. We gotta go to the next world now. Are we, I don't know if we're in here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, we're doing it. We're doing it right now. Sparrow to my poor child? <laughs> no, I never I never had any thoughts towards Spyro because he's a little cute. He's a little cute. Nice job, Fletcher, so much solid treasure, but beware, Spyro. Nasty's world is not the most friendly place you'll find. Look at kids' cartoons specific especially 90s and 2000s, they sexualize female animals. Exactly, that's what I'm talking about. This is why this is why this theory is because how we can't help it. I mean, they can't help it. Shut up! They can't help it. Okay? God damn it. Don't clip that. 
Now we clip it. It was it was a slip up of the tongue. It was a slip of the tongue. It was a slip of the tongue. It's not my fault. <laughs> it was a slip of the tongue, dude. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I swear. <laughs> I'm not. Hey, didn't I already free you? You're in nasty. I just like hot babes. It doesn't matter what kind of babe it is. Bring them on. I just I'm like babes. Reach the exit in each of nasty's <laughs> lands. Then you can challenge the Nork himself. Space, yeah, you see Space Jam, come on now, you're telling me that that bunny from Space Jam is not a babe? Kind of a babe. It's not, it's not our fault, man. Three games, TV shows did this to us. <clears throat> no, don't clip that. <laughs> uh, you got me, I like anything with boobs. You got me. Not my fault. I'm going to try and get some sleep and have a good rest of the stream. No worries, Mojo. I hope that you have a good sleep. A good sleep. And I'm sorry for, you know, <laughs> what you've had to hear this stream. It's not my fault, it's Chad. Chad's fault. Good sleep. Yeah, good sleep. Have a good sleep. Pleasant sleep. I don't know what's that. <laughs> what is a good sleep? That is that is actually true. What is a good sleep? I don't know. Christmas all Keep up the good work, Spyro. <clears throat> I expect Nasty's really starting to worry about you. He fucking better be. I'd be shaking in my North boots if I were him. <laughs> Thought Spyro was gonna say, I'd be shitting myself if I was him. I'd be shitting myself if I was him. No trouble at all, Keener. I'm happy to help. No, don't, don't bother. Don't bother, Jose. It's, it's absolutely fine. You don't need to. You don't need to. It's absolutely fine. We, we can live without it. We don't need it. Don't, don't worry yourself over it. <laughs> I've really put myself in it now, haven't I? But I've... Oh man, I should I should read I should read more to um be better at talking so I don't say stupid things like a silly. Thought she was the same character as Lola Bunny. Yeah, they're kind of similar, aren't they? Just hot bunny with titties. That's that's all you need to know. Gadget from Chippendale Rescue Rangers is sort of sexualized. Yeah, don't get me started on the Pokemon. Dude, that fucking rabbit Pokemon. What's going on with that Pokemon? Like, what the fuck? Imagine if you were a Pokemon trainer and then you found that in the grass. You'd just be like... <laughs> Gonna go to bed night, folks. Have a good stream. No worries, Corvus. Have a good sleep. Have a good sleep, Sir Corvix. I will see you next time. How to do bull big words? I don't know how to do words. I say incriminating things all the time. Wish I knew how to read. 
According to Pokemon Law, some people married their Pokemon. What? What? What do you mean? They just married their fucking Pikachu? That's weird. See, that's weird. That, uh, see, that, that's just weird because they're not, like, human. Like, they don't have human features, though, a lot of them. They're just animals. So that's weird. <clears throat> yeah, low, low pony or mop pony, however you say it, that's the one. That's the one that is, you know, makes people feel things. Yeah, why are bunnies always sexualized? Is it just because of the Playboy thing? Is that what it is? It's always bunnies. Leave the bunnies alone. They can't help being bunnies. And I ironically said these nuts are getting stuck in my throat because I was eating honey roasted peanuts. Nice. Nice. Why does this game seem like it's gone really loud again all of a sudden? It's so weird. Maybe it's just this level. Oof. Bunnies are so cute. I used to have some bunnies when wow. I was when I was younger. I never thought I'd be rescued, Very especially cute. by such a little dragon. Uh, what I mean is, such a little I dragon. I always believed in you, Spyro. You gotta believe. <laughs> you gotta believe. Is that for rapper re reference? Gotta do what? I gotta believe. Must be. Yeah. Did Parappa come out before this game then? This game was 1998. I just had to look at the stream just to see what year it was because I forgot. Episode of the cartoon where Ash gets a Mr. Mime as a stepdad? What? <laughs> Dude? Are you fucking serious? <laughs> that sounds terrifying. Oh my god, I missed a Mr. Mime as a dad. Oh, I hate that. The idea of that is horrible. That's awful. Parappa was 96. Since animation started, weirdos have been drawing sexy cartoons. Weirdos? That's very rude of you, Jose. That's very rude of you to say that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna... I'm gonna say that you're a fairy hater. Unwelcoming Jose. Shocking. Shocking. Okay, fine. If you're gonna just do that, that's fine. Good lord, good lord. You know what? I don't even think you need the key for that. I think that you can break that um, with a barrel. I think. Jose Fairy Fabic. Shocking. Shocking? Man, we're accepting of all people in here. Mr. Mime isn't his stepdad? Oh, did I... did I read it wrong? You gotta believe! 
What? After the first game, Spyro is voiced by Tom Kenny, SpongeBob. What? That's crazy. That's crazy town, dude. <laughs> no way. Inclusive fairies that gets cancelled by all the fairies. Shocking, shocking behaviour. They get started in ancient Egypt because all the gods are anthropomorphic. Dude, oh God, I hope, I fucking hope that like I can't. I, can't, I hope. Oh, I can't even say it. It's spoilers for, for a certain game. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. The fact of the matter is, is that I think that Egyptian gods are like the coolest gods. I think they're so cool. Very badass. Oh, do you remember in the, re in the remake of this game, they, they swapped out all the guns for, for like Splatoon guns? <laughs> Which is really funny. We can't be having games with guns in them because then the kids might think that guns actually exist and we can't be having that. Thank you for releasing me. Thank you for releasing me. Tom Kenny voices Spyro in Spyro 2 and 3 Enter the Dragonfly in the entirety of Reignited. Yeah, I, I kind of... I don't know if I'm the only one on this, but I kind of like... this. Oh my god! I kind of... No! Oh god. I kind of like the Spyro 1 voice more. Because he sounds like a little shit. You know? Like, he sounds like a little shit kid. Like, I'm gonna get nasty, Nork, huh? <laughs> Eats toast. They kind of lost a little bit of that with the sequels, but I still do, and I still do like the voice in the other games, to be fair. It, it's a good voice. It suits him. the rich history of animation and sexy Japan. lady animals. Yeah, we were. Why didn't you invite me soon in? Me. <laughs> yeah. When was the first time that you questioned yourself when you saw, like, um, a sexualized animal? It has to be, like, a lot of people's has to be a Lola Bunny. Like, it has to be. Because she's just a super hot babe. Oh, what? I fucked up because I hit the rat. Is that, is that, was that what happened there? 
Yeah, Elijah Wood voices him in those weird, those weird Spyro games that are like very adult dark. What? What? Oh my god. I'm too good. I'm too good at jumping. <laughs> That's my excuse. I'm too good. I'm too good, guys. Okay, I'm not gonna jump off it then. I'm just gonna let it. Yeah, there we go. Charge. Need to get that box at the end. I have never questioned myself. I always knew I was a peer. This is what I'm talking about, man. This is what I'm talking about. I'm not a fairy. I like things that are sexy. It's not my fault that sometimes they're animals. I did this. I did the same thing again. I did the same thing again. Too good at the jump. Little furry dude! <laughs> Little furry dude! <laughs> Wanna become famous? We're already famous, baby. We're already famous. What? What do you mean? <laughs> Lola shouldn't expand Dong, but she does. She does! It only took me like what five attempts. Uh, okay, I kind of rushed in there. Oh, oh yikes! There's the money shot. <laughs> you couldn't just put the bridge down for that chest? Yeah. Yeah. I could have done. I could have done. I just wanted to do it the hard way for no reason. That's all. It wasn't because I'm dumb or anything. Trust me. Trust me, I, kn I know what I'm doing at all times. <laughs> it, it wasn't because I just didn't think. <laughs> Good. I'm just providing entertainment for you guys, that's all. Oh god. No. No! No! Oh no. Oh, it's close. That was close. Oh, for fuck's sake. Got no sparks again. No sparks again. Yet again. Oh, goodness. Please tell me I got all the money. Yeah. She totally didn't think it was the only way. I didn't. I, I knew. I knew in my heart. <laughs> I, I was just providing entertainment. That's all. That's all. I was just. I was just stretching the stream out for longer. That's. That's all. You know me. Yeah, rats. Right. Gnasty Gnork. Your boy. 
We're going to the boss now. Oh, good. Boss time. Boss time. Can we do a first try? That's the question. Take your bets. Take your bets now. One of the mods can make a prediction if they like. I can't be bothered. But one of the mods can make a prediction if they want. Correct. There you go. <laughs> My mods, everybody. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I don't know how you do it through the chat, to be fair. says we uh, maybe yeah I've never done it through the chat I always have like I've got a button up on my stream manager that I just press oh my god that guy get fucked we're getting ganasty we're getting ganasty ah! oh god oh. Oh. all I can do is I'm just ban people you start it with pole. Ah, okay. I see. Can I predict on my own? What's that one? No! <laughs> what? You guys are killing me here. Are you fucking kidding me? Got no faith in me? Oh, feels bad, man. No. <laughs> no fucking way. Rude. Rude. <laughs> I don't blame you. I don't blame you for saying no. I don't blame you for it. I need to get all the gems, man. It stresses me out. There we go. I have faith in you. <laughs> I'm glad. I'm glad that some of you have faith in me. He's quite a speedy boy. <laughs> Fuck off, mate. Where are we at so far with this? <laughs> I got five dollars on the keyed stick. <laughs> poll and predict are different. Yeah, so a poll is is different than a prediction. A prediction is where you bet your points and then if you are correct, then you'll get a good payout on it. Which is pretty cool. I like it. I like it. Well, moment of truth. Moment of truth here. Get me tight. Your 
You're a toe snark, first try. First try, baby! You guys are losing all Sorry, your fucking so points! <laughs> what about because you didn't believe! Nasty you gotta believe! Toast. So Not me! No! Again in the <laughs> Good. Kingdom? Good! Well, mostly. I what? I still got some treasure to pick up. <laughs> Who what said no? Reveal yourselves! Who said no? I'm just joking. I'm just joking. It's all good fun. It's all good fun. You keep your 50k and you also get more as well, Lily. You have to tell us how much you're on after. Dear, dear. But it's not over yet, gang. Because there's still... There's still the extra level. Because we got 100%. So we've got to go and do the extra level. And then we're done. At least we've got a jam. We've got a jam. Wish I put more than 50 points in! Oh! Retro. Is that the one under the waterfall? Oh no, um, it's just if you get 100% in the game, then the extra world opens up in Nasty's realm, and then you can go and get all the treasure. There's loads of treasure in there. I think that's what puts you from 100% to 120%, I think. I, I miss it when games do that. It doesn't seem like games do that anymore, where you can go over 100% on a game. I think that's awesome. There we go, Stuart Copeland. There you go, it is Stuart Copeland, but it was spelt differently. It wasn't like the U-A-R-T spelling. It had a W in it. Clancy Brown. I'm not gonna try and say that. I'm not gonna try and say that, dude. Anyone else that we know? The other names don't really ring a bell. Dude, that fire voice is awesome. I wonder what he's doing now. I wonder what he's doing right now. I wonder if he's still a voice actor or if he's just chilling. He couldn't have got good money for it because I don't think the voice actors got paid very good. Like in the PS1 days. They probably just got handed like a fucking, here you go, he's a 50. Can you do some voices for us? <laughs> I love how those voted yes other than me. Only use 13k between them. <laughs> Alright. Well, can I, can I, um... Did, did I did did it waiting for result? How do I how do I make the result? I don't understand. Wait. Oh oh here we go here we go here we go. Choose outcome. Yes. There you go. I've done it now. How many points did you guys get? <laughs> how many how many points did you guys get? For that a lot. 31! <laughs> 154k? <laughs> Lily Nasty was all in on that. Now. So Holy shit. In there? I believe this is Nasty's treasure hoard. 124 points went from 3k to 7.6k. You, you got 11k? Dude. When you have reached 100%. I have got 100% though, sir. I have. We do it. Nasty's loot. Get nasty. Can't believe you lost me 130,000. I'm just too good at video games, Jay. That's why. I'm just too good. <laughs> I'm just too much of an expert. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's very funny how I died in loads of stupid parts of this game, but then smashed the boss. Just a typical Kahita stream, you know? Typical. Why is this music so good? I missed that. <laughs> I bet I 
didn't bet hesitation is defeat. Oh, don't say that phrase. It reminds me of fucking Sekiro. Ugh. Why is this music so good? I can't even concentrate. I can't even concentrate because it's so good. once we've completed the game. Are you okay with that? I think it will be appropriate.
Oh, it wasn't for that one. by talking about sexy animals. Hell yeah. Don't you know it? You know it. That is the stream. I feel like we're always talking about something weird on the stream. Why can't I not go any higher? You know what it is? I did this last time as well. When you go in this, um, you have to jump off the top or else it doesn't give you enough height. That's how it works. So I, I should have enough height now. Yeah. It's weird how that works, isn't it? The game must be programmed to let you fly as high as you can jump in the level. I don't know how they've done that, but. Dragon, you've defeated Ganasty Ganork, collected the dragon eggs, saved all the dragons, and recovered every bit of treasure in the Dragon Kingdom. How do you feel? I feel fired up, Bob, and I'm happy for the dragon world, of course. I certainly wouldn't want to spend the rest of my dragon days butting heads with Nasty Nork and his weird minions. What's a minion? Uh, never mind. You know what they say for every good battle, you need a good adversary. And I felt that Nasty, in spite of his misguided nature, Apple. was a worthy opponent. Do you shit? Uh oh. Yeah, it's kind of like we go in again. between a pink and a purple, isn't it? It's kind of in between that. I'd say it's more on the pink side, but I. <laughs> that might just be my eyes. We did it! Be the Spyro Gabe! Yay! What are we gonna do tomorrow? What we do tomorrow? What we do? It's a question. What we do now? Spyro 2? <laughs> Dude. I mean, we could. Crash? Oh god, I'm not playing Crash 1. I'm not playing Crash 1 because I'm shit at that one. That was a hard one.
was so funny. It was really funny. Lil Furry Dude! Lil Furry Dude! Play the new Crash is impossible? Absolutely not. Crash 4 looks miserable to 100%. Looks miserable. Do a poll. Crash Bandicoot warped! <laughs> Dude, I, I don't know. Maybe. All right. Should we do a poll on the stream now? What do you guys reckon? Like we can do a poll now, I guess, on stream while everybody's here. We'll do it. All right. What do we want? Um. Poll time. All right, so what games are we putting on this? What, ga what games? We've got Crash 3. We've got Jack and Daxter. Jack and Daxter. Um, what else have we got, guys? What, what, what else did you guys say? Um, ooh! ooh. <laughs> Um, Spyro 2, Spyro 2, any other ones, any other ones on the poll or is, is that it? We've got Crash 3, Jack and Daxter or Spyro 2 so far. Is that, is that enough? Should we do a poll with that? You reckon? Only problem is that with the callback is that I have to waste channel points on the highlight message every time as the dude highlighted every freaking message. So good. <laughs> That's so funny. Game tomorrow. Yeah, we'll just we'll just keep it as those three games then. Alright guys, you've got two minutes. You got two minutes to vote for your favorite. You've got Crash 3. Sparrow 2 or Jack and Daxter. I don't mind playing any of those games. I I like all of those games, so I don't mind. What about Sly Cooper? We played Sly Cooper on stream semi recently. And I love that game as well. But we haven't played Sly 2 on stream yet, so we're gonna have to play that at some point because Sly 2 is fucking awesome. Really good game. Debatably even better than the first one. Crash 3 is winning. Crash 3 is winning. But yeah, I, I, I pretty much like any... Like, what's going on with my eyebrow here, by the way? What's happening there? <laughs> I pretty much like any platformer. Any platformer, I'm easy. I'm easy. I, li I like platformers. Oh, Crash 3 is winning. Crash 3 is winning. I'm gonna- I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I'm not very good at Crash 3. I'm not very good at it. Thank you. Rewindings for losers. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. I like your name. Platformers until I get caught jump syndrome, yeah. Caught jump syndrome happens sometimes. Serious condition, Lily. It's a serious condition. Tomb Raider 1 is a platformer. Clums, I'm not playing Tomb Raider, alright? I'm not playing Tomb Raider. Alright, I know that you're currently suffering through that game. I don't want to suffer through it. I don't want to suffer through that game, man. I don't want to. I don't want to. It's straight up. Alright, Crash 3 is the winner. We are playing Crash 3. That's it. Crash 3. Woo! Yeah, baby! That's what I've been waiting for! That's what it's all about! Woo! <laughs> That's what people want! That's what the people want! That's what the people want! So we do that. We do Crash 3 tomorrow, guys. And I won't be able to finish it all in one stream, probably, because it's, you know... I'm, I'm not as good at that game as I am at this game, so... We'll see how far we get at it, but I'll give it a good go. 
I won't promise that I will do those time trials because I'm really shit at time trials in that game. Like, the relics are the ones that I struggle with the most. I don't mind doing the gems because it's just collect all the boxes, but the relic ones are a nightmare because you've got to do the levels fast. And me trying to play a game fast, I don't know. I don't know, man. <clears throat> I think if you get everything apart from the relics, it might still put it up to 100%. It's just the relics put it above 100%, but I can't actually remember. It's been so long since I played it, I don't remember. Lots of caffeine for tomorrow, oh god. Oh god, maybe I'll get myself some monster energy. Monster energy drinks. But yeah, guys. Um, I hope that you've enjoyed the stream. I've enjoyed the stream considering that I didn't know what I was playing until literally like an hour before stream and I just decided to choose Spyro. <laughs> I'd say that it's been it's been a really fun stream. I've enjoyed playing Spyro. I always enjoy playing this game. It's so much fun. So much fun. So yeah guys. I'm expecting the top tips and tricks for Crash 3 because I don't know like all of the because some of the gems are like those weird hidden gems that you can only get if you go through a certain level a certain way and stuff like that and i don't remember so if anybody has any knowledge on on that kind of stuff then please let me know <clears throat> oh yeah google will save us because some of them are really cryptic aren't they some of the gems yeah guys if anyone would like to join the discord you are free to join the Discord. There's the link to it. And if anybody would like to follow me on anything, I've got some socials as well. But before we end the stream, don't go anywhere, guys, because we're going to be raiding somebody. We're going to be raiding somebody. I don't know who, but we're going to find someone. That's for sure. Oh my god, there's nobody online! <laughs> Dude, there's no one online! What do you mean? Where is everybody? Where is everybody? Where are all the streamers at? Where are they, where are they gone? Is everybody just quit streaming or what? Where, why is there nobody online? There's nobody online right now. What's going on? Everyone's asleep, dude. All streamers are in here. <laughs> Glove switcher stream on. <laughs> Imagine. Shall we see if anybody's playing Spyro? We'll see if anybody's playing Spyro then. I'll just type in Spyro the dragon. Let's see. We've got quite a few people that are playing, but they're, they're doing speedruns, man. I don't I don't want to raid into a speedrun in case it fucks them up. You know, I don't, I don't want to be the one that ruins the fucking run. How, how sad would that be? Oh, yikers. Oh, yikers. Is there anybody online that anybody knows right now? Check in, check in good old retro. Good old retro. Let's see. Any, any any video games? Any any video game enjoyers? In here? Hmm. 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 Lots of big boys are on. <laughs> Dude. Where is everybody? Who's this guy? Who's this guy? Let me look at him. Let me look at this guy. I'm just gonna pick someone. I'm gonna pick someone random then. That's it. Emmett is playing terrible Code Veronica. <laughs> Maybe we should go see Emma then. Can we go see Emma? We go see Emma. Why not? Why not? Thank you for posting the raid messages, Lily. Um, thank you so much. 
top raid messages for subs, bottom raid messages for non-subs. Um, we are going to go over to Emma, who is Aussie streamer, right? I'm not just making that shit up, I hope. <laughs> Right, we're gonna raid. Okay, Veronica. Um, and yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow. We're gonna be playing Crash Three. I'm excited. Thank you everybody for today, by the way. Um, whoever anonymous is that gifted all those subs, I very much appreciate it. I don't know who you are, but we love you very much. We love you very much, and we appreciate you. Um, and everybody else that subbed and was here, or that's been lurking, I love all you guys very much. And thank you everybody for staying for the raid as well, because I know that I do chat shit for ages before I raid someone, so I do appreciate that. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Night night everybody! Bye! Bye guys! Bye! Hello. <laughs> uh, welcome in, is it Jose? Um, Carnage, hello, how you doing?